Hello, welcome to Board Games with Niramas. I'm Joseph and I'm here with Draco as usual. Today we are hosting a werewolf game, another werewolf game uh, over Zoom online with a bunch of lovely people here that's going to fight it out. It's going to be villagers against werewolves as usual and we'll see how it ends up. Now, I wanted to do a little bit of an intro here to explain a few things before the game gets started. I want to explain some roles and how the structure of the game is. So, first of all, I use a little bit of a different structure in my games than in most werewolf games standardly. And so in my games we're trying to find two candidates each day and these two candidates will go up against each other in a boat and uh, one of them will, will be uh, killed by the village. So um, that, that changes up a little bit and I also have some new things I'm trying here where people close their eyes, one person gets to look on the boats. Uh, so that's a little bit different from, from most werewolf games. Now let me go over the roles as well because it could be a bit confusing. There's a bunch of roles that I made up myself. Uh, I also call them the Guami roles. This is the Guami village because my favorite player is uh, called Guami. So it's an you know honor in honor of Guami. So let me get started. We're going to have the villagers, the plain villagers. They don't really know anything. They don't get any information. They don't wake up during the nights. They're trying to figure out, like a deduction, they're trying to figure out who the werewolves are. And, you know, they win if they can get rid of all the werewolves. Then there's going to be a bunch of these villagers that have special roles. So to start off here, uh, we have the Guami man. And the Guami man wakes up every night. They get to choose between a few different options. Rand I randomize my, my little things that I show and they get to choose between two options each night. They can do different actions, as you will see. We also have a wannabe Guami man. Whatever the Guami man does not choose between the two options they get, the Guami, the wannabe Guami man has to do that the other one. So that makes it interesting in that choice because you know that whatever you don't choose, someone else will get to do if that person is alive as well. Yeah, you'll see that later on. Then we have the Guami hag. The Guami hag is like the old hag from Ultimate Werewolf, basically. It wakes up every night and it could choose to send someone out of the village. The, my twist to it though is that it's not just for the next day, it's for the next day and the next night that the, that person is gone from the village. Which means they, you know, they cannot vote, they cannot get killed or do their action the next night and so on. But also they get to look at the votes uh, when they're gone. They do not get to look at the night face obviously though. Then we also have the Guami voter. The Guami voter has to alternate between voting up and down. So they don't really get to decide themselves how they vote, except for the first time they vote. Then they choose where they start, but then they have to alternate for the rest of the game. Then we have the baby dragon, of course. Draco's favorite role. The baby dragon is a villager, uh, basically a plain villager, but it has two lives. So if the village tries to vote it off, it will stay around for one extra time. Or if the werewolf is targeted during night, it will also not die the first time. Uh, it cannot, however, um, uh, sort of, it doesn't have any special power in this format. I have experimented where the baby dragon can breed fire and kill someone each night, but it's not in this game. Then there's also some hunters. Uh, so the hunters, when they die, they get to kill someone on their way out. But in other regards, they are normal villagers. We have a bodyguard. The bodyguard wakes up every night and they get to choose someone to protect. That person cannot be killed by the werewolves. They cannot choose the same person two nights in a row though. Then we have the seer. The seer wakes up every night, gets to ask me about a player and I will tell them werewolf or not a werewolf. Uh, so they, try, they are trying to find out who the werewolves are. But of course there could be fakes as well as we get to in a bit here. Uh, then we have the sort of attributes that the villagers can have. So in my games, you, you have your role, but then you can also on top of that have something else. So you could be a lichen, which is one of those fakes. A lichen is a villager, but it's very hairy. So if the seer looks at it at night, I'm going to tell them it's a werewolf, but it's actually just a villager. Then we also have some curse players. Uh, all of these roles, all of these attributes are, by the way, zero to three. So we might have one, we might not have one, we might have three. So the cursed, they are a normal villager, but if they get targeted at night by the werewolves, they don't die. Instead, they turn into a new werewolf. And I will tell them, oh, you are now a werewolf. And, you know. Then, hunter in my games are also an attribute. So uh, 
we could have zero to three hunters and um, you know those people will know that they are a hunter though and then we have the guami bots this is something new that i'm working on i will develop this more and more i think it's really fun it's basically a well a synthetic uh, you know uh, robotic uh, creature that lives in the village it, it is a villager for all intents and purposes but it, well, at least in this game but it has a quirk it has something something went wrong in the programming so they have to do a certain thing so at the beginning of the game i will tell them you have to do this uh, it could be something they have to do each day or each vote or they have to say a certain thing every day and if they don't do that then i will kill them during night so they have to do the thing and they cannot come out and say that they, what what it is they have to do either and this makes for a lot of fun confusion in the game then of course we have the werewolf team unknown number of werewolves the werewolves are trying to eat the villagers they're hungry at night and if they can get to parity so it's two werewolves left and two villagers they instantly win and then we have a special werewolf called the guami wolf the guami wolf wakes up the first night and they get to cho choose between two different roles the werewolf roles uh, which one they want to be and well you see how that works later on but one of these roles could be a wolfman and the wolfman looks like a villager if the seer checks them uh, there's also a few different others that you might uh, encounter here there's also a wannabe guami wolf and the wannabe gets whatever the guami wolf didn't take so it, it's just sort of the same structure as with the guami man but this just happens the first night before the actual game starts uh, and in this game uh, the the wannabe guami wolf actually ends up with a, a active role uh, so they get to do something at, at some point in the game, which you will see here later on. And then there's also going to be a werewolf hunter. And that's just like a hunter. When they die, they get to take someone with them. Then, special in this game, uh, as you've seen from the title here, we also have a Guamicabra. It's basically just a Chupacabra from the Ultimate Werewolf game. But I just you know made the name funnier. So the function of it is the same. Every night it wakes up, it gets to point at someone if it chooses... A, a a villager nothing happens if it chooses if it points at a werewolf that werewolf will die and finally one more thing that the guami wolf will do before the game starts on night zero is to choose a player to become a minion and the minion is on you know it's helping the it wants to win with the werewolves it wins if the werewolves win and it doesn't count as a werewolf in regards of like if the CEO checks them, they're not a werewolf. If, if it's two werewolves and the minion plus three villagers, the werewolves doesn't win instantly. So, But it's still trying to help the werewolves out. So that's all the roles. I hope it made some sense and it will make more sense as you watch the game. A lot of fun things happen. This is my favorite game that I have been moderating. Uh, I really like how this game turned out and it's a really exciting end to the game as well. So stick to it uh, it's a long game but i hope you will enjoy it and have fun and we'll be back with more werewolf games soon as well let's mute everyone and go to the first night there we go and let's hope that i can get this uh going i mean there might be some mess ups at some point but you know we'll try so Everyone is asleep. Welcome back to the Guami village. You're here again or like you heard about this place It's a bit chaotic here earlier, but now you know things seems to spin out of control uh, For real and it seems to just get worse and worse But there is a new hope because we do have made these robot robots that maybe they can help us somehow I don't know how they would help the village But you know at least you did you made them and you hope they would do some good So let's start with the werewolves and that includes you know the, the Guami wolf and the wannabe guami wolf everyone who identifies as a werewolf you can wake up you can give a little wave to each other and uh, all right and then you can go back to sleep then i would like the and i'm gonna be, be very clear now i want the guami wolf not the wannabe just the guami wolf to wake up and I am going to give you two options. So do you want to be, here we go. Do you want to be the top or the bottom of this? You want to be that? Okay. 
than you are that for the rest of the game. Uh, but don't go to sleep yet. I have some other things to bring up with you here. Uh, I'm just going to note down what you've chosen though. Um, okay. Then you, I want you to pick a player who becomes the Gminion. So, and the, you know. Okay, thank you. So that's everything I need from you right now. Thank you. You can go back to sleep. And I would like to ask the wannabe Guami Wolf to wake up. And you are this. All right. Okay, then let's see, where are we? We need the Guami man to wake up. Only the Guami man, not the wannabe, just the Guami man. You can wake up. And you're going to get two options here. And these will not be randomized because that wouldn't make any sense on night one. Instead, I'm going to choose something here that could be fun. So you will do the top or the bottom of these. So you get to choose. You want to do that. So who do you want to do what it is you're doing too? Thank you. So you can go back to sleep. Then I would like the wannabe Guami man, the wannabe Guami man to wake up. And you have to do this. So who do you want to do that to? Thank you. Then we are going to have the seer wake up. The seer can wake up and who do you want to check? Oh wait, uh, oh yeah, 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 I'm okay. All right. So that was the seer. Uh, just for the sake of it, let's have the bodyguard wake up. Nobody's going to die. I just want to wave and just check so you know who you are. And let's also have the Guami Hag wake up. You're not going to send anyone out yet because it would be too quick and boring, but that's good. And then finally, I want the Guami Cabra to wake up and just say hi. And yeah, you can go back to sleep and everyone is asleep and then everyone can wake up and Welcome to day one in the village. Why did I mute myself? Um, yeah, you're supposed to unmute yourself. I can't do that for you. Um, all right. Then again, I will say this. I, I won't keep saying this because that could be some kind of meta in that. Uh, I will remind you that check your messages once in a while uh, because things might change in the village. So have fun with it. You know, and I didn't die, but you know, there's werewolves. You need to kill them. <laughs> well, did anyone else have a good night's sleep? I sure had a long night's rest. I saw yeah. Mike Evans score a touchdown. I almost. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's about it. That's about it. Nice. So, Joseph, I assume you already sent the minion that, or the Gwimian, that he or she is the Gwimian. Yeah, I, ha I have done that. Yeah. <laughs> so, Chris and Melissa are obvious Gwimian targets, I assume. Yeah, I was going to say that that what targets you can figure out. Gwimian. Minion. I think it Minion. Oh, okay. What are you saying? Yeah, I wasn't sure what you were saying there. There's not many rules, and I was like, that's not a now rule. Now we got Lucas right. making up rules. <laughs> <laughs> Just pitching ideas for the next Guami village. Yeah, exactly. <laughs>
Okay, so like, how do we normally do this? Because this is my first time in the Guami village, so... Uh, no uh, we knows. sack it right away. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> oh. oh, sorry, I, f I forgot something. Uh, I, someone was also silenced. I don't know why, but Paul, Classy Paul, you can't talk for this day. Oh, okay. What's new? It'll be a big thing. <laughs> Great. It's, 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 it's classic Paul. Yeah, sometimes he doesn't talk. And sometimes that makes him suspicious. And sometimes he doesn't I know, right? <laughs> I love it because there's so many times with Paul, it's always, dude, you're way too quiet this game. You're a werewolf. Or the next game, dude, you've been talking way too much. You're a werewolf. He's the same way every time. <laughs> That's why I got Joseph last night. Yeah. He didn't say very much at all. Yeah. He was good. I was good. <laughs> I know, but he was playing completely different than he normally does. Yeah, so a quick rules question. Yeah. I'm assuming that the um, if the Guami bots have a role which requires them to say something and they're silent, then they can just get their rule that day rather than automatically dying. No, uh, yeah, okay. If they're, if they're silenced, then I'm not going to count that day. They're going to be, like, excluded from their whatever their quirk or... If, if, the, quirk, guess, if the quirk involves talking, it might not do you that, but no. Oh. Like the robots were in Tom's, uh, some Tom's Werewolves games. Adam Craft, are you the Wolfman again? No, I am not. Okay. What did you call him? Wolfman, I think. Yeah. I was a Wolfman in yesterday's game. Well, I will say uh, that the the Guami Wolf thing is pretty cool because uh, you basically introduced eight roles into the game but you only need to call two of them because it's the guami wolf and the the, the wannabe guami wolf and nobody knows what that is as opposed to having to read eight things yeah, yeah, yeah. Really yeah. matthew <laughs> are you gonna nominate now it was jugan oh, that well, talked about that actually in. he made yeah. a mystic wolf <laughs> mystic role no, that was just me trying to uh give the village the best chance of winning i know so hey i got a question for everyone so the wannabe guami for the village team um I feel like they could probably play a little loosey goosey this game where if they find information because to, to, to let the village know possibly early due to the reason of this, they're going to be replaced with another Guami wannabe. That's an interesting so, point, actually. It means yeah. Yeah. The real Guami shouldn't be using the C action. They should leave that to the yeah, that is a point. and the wannabe can come out. Now, there is yeah. one fault with that, which is that the, the wannabe probably won't share that they check somebody so we might literally check the same person every time well they, well, they should share it immediately that's what the chef said that's you know? my okay. point they should okay. play a little bit more loose because they can be replaced with another wannabe yeah i agree with the chef they, they should be they should be vocal and giving their information out as well as they, they don't have to place, come they, out as a wannabe but they they, they can for the first well, couple well, rounds but well, i think afterwards maybe not because we might lose the guami man at some point that's true yeah. Well, yeah, just we, something, the first just couple rounds, playing, I think yeah. so. Yeah, Have I get that. Lost it and not know. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Because okay. none of us know what to do now. Yeah, yeah no, I, yeah. I was just trying. Well, I was just trying to get the. Second. We just can't nominate. I was just getting the Guami killing the, 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 you know, the coming forward and then them dying and then them being replaced thing straight in my head because there's mm -hmm. so I have Guami written down about. I, too many times. <laughs> hey, you just read G. I figured that out about halfway mm -hmm. through. So now do we just start nominating quiet people to get them to talk? Well, not no, in no, this game. no, 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 not, not in this game. Not, no, that's not... You'll be you'll be voted out quicker than yep. you can't do right that on here. rice. <laughs> you gotta really, you gotta really know what you're doing here. Guys, one second. I'm gonna hop That's off really quick. Uh, I'm switching over to my my hotspot yeah, here. Sure, sure. My internet's okay. kind of that sounds suspicious. I'm, I'm suspicious of that. Right away. He's oh, using his old tech powers. Really... Yeah. He has a separate office where he does his killing. I'm suspicious of people's faces. I can't see. Wait, you can't Everyone's see right people's now. faces. I can't. Oh, Chris see is Graham. hiding. Uh, Graham is far away, and Jugan's <laughs> got his hand over half his All face. All right. Chris is using his mic. <laughs> And the yeah, one. I Chris, can't do anything to please you, and, chef. And hey, Chris, my dog <laughs> loves to, to lay right in front of the fireplace, just to let you know. Wait, what type of dog is it? A wolf dog? No. <laughs> it's a, it's uh, a canine. It doesn't the, matter. The it's a canine. Come... <laughs> it's an alpha dog. It's an alpha nice dog. Fireplace. <laughs> oh, my dog is such a curmudgeon. <laughs> He's 11, and he just don't give a shit about nothing. Oh, I love those types of dogs. That was my dog for like the last 10 years, and he was just... Gave no Fs. So we need to find candidates to uh, 
yeah, kill. Yeah. yeah, so like, I, right, so this is the first time playing and there's so many roles. Is there something that, is there any role that could possibly tell us some information from the first night that it wouldn't be a disaster for them to tell us? Well, they want to be Guomi, can, could come out if he wants to. If he had some information. There's two depends roles, on, there's two roles that cannot come out, and that's the voter and the baby dragon. Everyone else are free to. Okay. Oh, and sorry, Jürgen. Right? Yeah. But, I mean, I suppose if they haven't found anything that's of use, then... Oh, I don't know, because then if they die... But, yeah, I mean, but... probably just silence Paul, and we all know that. So... That would be my you guess. You should nominate Paul just to see how he has to defend himself in the silence. <laughs> that is just cruel. That is wrong. I've seen it happen before. I think yeah. Paul Paul before. Paul could be an amazing charades player. We don't know. I think well, he needed many. Maybe I didn't say it, but obviously oh. the, the Guomi bots can't say that they're Guomi bots either. I yes. don't know if I said that. Yes. No, I did. Just wait. I'm unmuted. I want to see. I want to see Paul defend himself via mime. That would be excellent. <laughs> American sign language. Uh, one thing I will say: is sign language. Nominating people in this is not the same because they're one of two people, and one of them definitely will die. So it might not be as funny to nominate Paul just to watch him do sign language because he very well may get voted out because of that. True. That's a good point. <laughs> <laughs> so many people have their hands over their faces. You mean over what? Oh, Chris. You, okay. Watch, watch. A lot of people are sitting here like this. And, I mean, so many people. Could Benji's that be a quirk? Face. Even Melissa had her hand over his face. Chris got the microphone in front. I've just noticed Adam Big Cheese had his hand over his face. Yeah, oh, I have like a beard. I'm always. Crazy. That's normal. Could these be quirks? I know, but I'm trying. I'm I'm That's trying to channel my inner okay. Melissa, trying to figure out what she sees in these people. I'm just, I'm just trying. <laughs> this is... uh, oh, oh, oh! I think Paul's oh, trying to villager. Paul is a villager. That's awesome! I love he it. He has the villager. Uh, he has, he has the Animal Crossing villager. I love yeah. it. I love Are it. you, as a werewolf, preparing to eat that villager? Is that what you're doing? <laughs> <going as? laughs> I'm gonna actually state one thing really, really quick. I'd like to I'd like to appreciate uh, Gwalix over there. I think he's the only one that's wearing purple right now. What? <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, I joined last night. <laughs> oh, just <laughs> Captain Purple, no, <laughs> Captain Grammy right there. Uh... Ben's gonna get some purple on too. I will say it's a bit weird that Guami is not here. It's the first time he's not in the village, so. Mm -hmm. Really? He'll show her game and then get I in. don't think I heard you say that. Oh, he's on well. vacation. Boy, Jugen's, uh, if you, if he's left. He did this video as a premiere. I, 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 I really can't, can't see his face on the comments. So who wants really to nominate Jugen? No, I'm just kidding. Jugen I know, I feel really bad. Like if cool. I was making it purple. Hey, hey, Jugen, you got nominated. <laughs> um, <laughs> maybe. Kidding, <laughs> just Purple, oh, purple, nice. For, I think for, for the sake of the village, I'm gonna come out and i'm i'm the wannabe wami man and i checked many and he's good okay okay thanks <laughs> i knew no, my hand was good okay yeah, hang on who was checked out i'm just looking around my screen oh, oh yeah, manny yeah. okay got it got it i couldn't see you there for a second <laughs> so that would mean that the guami man had the choice between c or silence and decided to silence classic poll yep yeah. Seen that way. Uh, kind of makes sense. So we have a smart Guami Man player because he chose to give C to the Guami Wannabe. Um, remember, so just, there is. That changes there are the three likes in it. Too. The Wannabe does. Oh, but the lichen appears to this year as a wolf. Oh, as a wolf, right? that's right. So he's good. But we do have. We might have a wolf. We might have a wolf. Wait, I thought the lichen appeared as a villager. Oh, wait, it looks like a werewolf. No. Okay, yeah, no, I've yeah. got that down. Yeah. My bad. Sorry. Hey, are, are you a wolf, man? Me? Who's no. that him, Dad? Oh. But we might have curse, so it is early, but yes, right now, cursed, correct. Manny, you are good. That's true, yeah. We have zero to three cursed. Yeah. Okay, so Manny, Ma good Manny is good for right now. Yeah, good with a, <laughs> good with a question mark. Yes. What do the yeah. curse do again? <laughs> They the cursed. I think do they turn into war? They don't we're die. They become a werewolf. Does the curse know they're cursed? No. 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 Okay. 
I think they only turn into werewolves if they're killed by werewolves, though. Is that correct? Right. Yeah, yeah. Correct. the werewolves kill them, they turn into I think it's more interesting if they do now. Uh, Elliot, to answer, did you ask about the, the cub? I asked what the curse did. Oh, the curse. And then click answers. So we still need candidates to get this, uh, you know, the village uh, has to do <clears> something <throat> each day, so. Yeah, because uh, there is potentially what a uh, starving wolf, too. Oh. You know what? Let's get to started. I nominate myself. Wow. Okay. Jirgan Jir Jir nominates himself. Mm. Is there a second for I that? I just want to see some votes. <laughs> oh, no, no. That, well, no, it that's not how it works. Yeah, wait, 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 you wait, should through that. It's not how it works. No. <laughs> Isn't there a, wait, wait, wait. There was a second, but hang on. I think we, don't we only have one <laughs> I vote? Don't, I think he said don't second that. All right. Uh, what did you say? I didn't I hear a like, second. Uh, I said, don't second that. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Because I was okay. like, we, so, I thought we only had one vote, and I was like, we, we have no information. Yeah, you, you, can, you, can, you can nominate yourself if you want to. You can second yourself. But just to clarify that you're never going to see votes, sort of. So uh, You're not doing it like last time, like rolling it? Yeah, yeah. yeah one person is going to see it, but it might not be you. So. Well, and the other, the other thing Wait, is you can... that two people will be picked, one of which gets voted out. So if you nominate yourself, there's a 50% chance you're getting voted out. As, as long as we yeah, are an equal true. number, that's true. I forgot about that. As long as we are an equal number, there could be a no kill if it's. Which, for the record, same I number. was this close to seconding you because I don't want to be that the fifty-fifty guy, and you were okay with it for some reason. <laughs> so <laughs> well, we, I keep forgetting in to... uh, Guami Village, just the people competing at each other. Yeah, I remember the like you can't see unless you get the roll. I forgot it was. Head it it changes Never every mind. time. Um, yeah. So we need to get some nominations, so uh, I'm going to throw one out, and it's just because when Trey mentioned that uh, a lot of people had their hands over their mouths, I was watching Ben, and he immediately shot his hand down, which tells me that he's trying to manage people's perceptions, so I'm wondering why he did that. So I'm going to nominate Ben. So we have a nomination for Ben. Second. Is second? Oh, there's a second. Let's see. Can so you ben, just ask oh, him without nominating him? Ben is the first candidate, and now we're looking before for we, someone to go up against Before we do him. a second... Is it worthwhile to maybe not kill today? The reasons why is only one person is going to be able to see the votes today, whereas tomorrow two people will see the votes. You'll have I, don't, I don't think we have much choice really to not kill. kill. Uh, the only yeah, way there would be a starving wolf. The only way you could do that. Yeah, but then we would find out if there's a starving wolf. But the only way you could do that, Matthew, is if uh, 11 people voted for one person, 11 voted for oh, the other. Oh, we can't not. We oh, can't not. not yeah. Oh, okay. Sorry. I thought we could maybe do that. Never mind then. No, I should have been. The clear. starving wolf is super nerfed in this game. Yeah, I, yeah, with that, with how they're promoting it. I, I don't want to nominate necessarily because I haven't actually played enough games with her to know. But there was a discussion earlier today where one of Flick's tells is when she says she's confused, and that was the first thing she said. To yeah, me. but in this game, I she's mean, allowed to be confused. I I yeah, I was gonna say <laughs> if you're not confused in this game, that'd be a little suspicious. In my defense, in that game, I was genuinely confused, and then I decided to just play with it. And roll with it but in this one i like that's my first page well i'm not going to show you but like it's an entire page of just notes and that's just it. writing down the rolls yeah. so like uh i am still trying to get the guami stuff all around in my head yeah. so it, that page. that's literally yeah although i'm on to my second page so you know <laughs> well, it's really well, I, I, I would suggest to make it fair as i think no one has any hints on who is suspicious or not, I would let Ben nominate his opponent. Yeah, that, that always is fair. I mean, I don't know who to nominate, so any suggestions? <laughs> not me. I like that, that was good. <laughs> so I don't know who made the comment about Flick, and I didn't actually read that earlier, whoever was talking about the, you know, why she was suspicious, but I wrote her name down, so. I mentioned I nominate Flick. We have a nomination for Flick. I second. And there's a second. Okay. So we have our two so, candidates. Yeah. So when Melissa speaks, you listen. <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to uh, hear defenses for the other. Like, you know, Ben can start uh, explaining why you shouldn't kill him, why you should kill Flick instead, uh, however you want to do it. But, you know, so uh, please don't interrupt, Ben. Sure. Um, yeah, I mean, you caught on, Alex. I did have my hand over my face. I literally just put it there, and then Trey said that, and I was like, God oh, dang it. Um, 
that's something I often do. I mean, anybody that's played with me more than once knows that I often will sit with my hand like this when I'm thinking about stuff. Um, so that was just once Trey said that I was like, oh crap, I probably look suspicious now. And apparently taking it down made me look suspicious. <laughs> um, I, I mean, I don't have any information at this point. It's the first day, nothing's really happened, but I do have a role. You don't want to kill me. Um, that's it. Okay, so let's hear it from Flick. Yes, yeah, so um, it's my first time in the Guami village. I was initially thinking about just watching tonight, and then I decided to jump in kind of last minute because I spotted that there were slots free on the um, board gaming site thing that I have two registrations on randomly. Um, and so, yeah, it's all just kind of a bit new to me, and Guami is repeated like repeatedly on this page. So uh, I think the problem with this one is it's going to take me a couple of rounds to kind of get my feet and, and figure it out. And that's basically it. Um, it's a little out of my depth because I'm usually playing just like werewolf. And then when I did ultimate werewolf, there was definitely fewer rules. So uh, that's it. It's, it's just that I haven't, it's my first time playing this particular version of werewolf um, with this many rules, so. Okay, so, so as I usually do in my games, if you haven't played in those before, uh, this is a bit different from a lot of other moderators. After the defenses, I will allow for like two minutes of questions uh -huh. and answers. So if anyone has questions for the candidates, you can't discuss other stuff back and forth. But if you have questions for the candidates, you can do them now. So Flick, you're saying there's nothing for speaking for you that we should kill you instead of Ben or other, or other way around. Well, I can't see really what benefit it would be in killing me, but then at the minute I can't see what benefit it would be killing Ben either, because like I don't really well, know yeah. who's what role. Ben, ben, that's ben, the thing. Yeah, Ben claimed the role. Yeah. Yeah, you didn't say uh, anything about a role. Was it that? Well, hang on. Was it? I do know I'm a villager, but like I do, you know, I wasn't sure whether or not we we're supposed to be saying what sort of villager we are, because like I don't know other than villager. Like I could guess, but just like. Maybe you can guess werewolf. <laughs> to be honest, if someone was to guess werewolf, there's like what eight versions? Hang on, there's eight, nine, ten. I have too many on here. Um, there's a lot, so like I have no idea. Um, yeah, like Do literally, I... was it? I had planned just to watch this because I haven't actually seen one of these on YouTube before. Um, I've just not had the time, so I'd kind of thought I'd sit in and watch, and then I sort of jumped in. So, uh, yeah, sort of a sink or swim type thing. All right, so I think we are uh, ready. Well, I had a question. Uh, yeah, who yeah. asked the last question? So uh, Ben uh, said he has a role, but he doesn't want to say it. And I've heard lots of people, and I don't know if it's true or not, but lots of people have said, I'm always, oh, Lucas is one of them, and he's nodding his head. I'm always suspicious of people that say I have a role, but then don't say what the role is. 100%. I don't know if that makes sense on the first, like, one or two days, though, personally. Well, he doesn't die now. Well, I just you heard it. a target at night. Here. Well, it's 50 50, so I. It's, it's different yeah. in a normal one where it's you're voting on that person at the end. When you're voting between two people and one person says, I have a role, and the other person says, I don't have a role, it's okay to kill me. It I just don't think that's as suspicious as in a normal game when it's you're going to die unless you come out exactly with what you have. So, Kyle, well, this, is, this is that time. This is one like a third nomination. To die. It's not the third different. nomination because you're voting between two people. Okay. It's not the same thing. I, but you <laughs> have a chance. I'm going to be a bit rude to keep the game moving. So I will sort of two minutes and then I will break uh, in the middle of things. So sorry for that. But okay, so let's uh, randomize it up. I figured out the system here where I can roll two dice and I can rotate around my list, so to speak, uh, in order to find who gets to watch. So let's start with that. And that's there. And then we do this. So that is Sean. Sean, you get to watch the vote. You also get to vote after everyone else. Uh, so you get to watch and then vote uh, whenever you want. So just to uh, be clear here, if you vote up, you want to kill Ben. If you vote down, you want to kill Flick. So everyone, put up your hand, close your eyes. And then I will count down. So again, up for Ben, down for Flick in three, Two, one. And now Sean gets to vote as well. So 
So everyone can take down your hands. And then you can open your eyes. And we have a result. I'm sorry, Flick, but you have been killed by the village. And Flick was a werewolf. And good night, everyone. All right. That was uh, intense. Day one voting. I, I, I find this voting system intense just watching it. Uh, I want to play with this system at some point if someone wants to moderate with these rules. All right. So let's get started here uh, with a normal night for the first time. So standard night. So we're going to start with the Guami Man. So Guami Man, wake up. And I will give you two options here. And now it is random. So you can do the top or the bottom here. You want to do that? Alright, so who do you want to do it to? Thank you. You can go back to sleep. And we are going to have the uh, wannabe Guami Man wake up. And you have to do this. So who do you want to do it to? Thank you. Then let's have the bodyguard wake up. So bodyguard, who do you want to protect? Thank you. Then let's have all the lovely, or no, you're not lovely, but all the werewolves wake up. Um, regardless of uh, kind of weird stuff you have going on. Um, and you will choose someone to try to kill. And in this game, you are not allowed to like communicate stuff because we have these weird roles that it's no fun if you can tell people everything. So you need to decide We're not really getting anywhere here. All right, thank you. You can go back to sleep. Then let's have the Gminion. The Gminion can wake up. Or the Minion, just to make it easier uh, for me to stop saying that. So, uh, Minion, do you want to wake up? Uh, okay. We are going to do this. Everyone wake up. And look at your chat. Because obviously someone doesn't know that they are, are a Minion. So I'll give you guys a few seconds to look at your chat. And then everyone can go to sleep. And I will ask the Minion to wake up. And you get to do a seer check, basically. So you can choose someone that you get to see if they are a werewolf or not. So that you can find your brothers. All right, you can go to sleep. And then we want to, I want to have the Guamicabra wake up. And you can choose someone to kill or try to kill. You have to choose someone. You're hungry, you need to eat. Thank you. You can go to sleep 
And let's have the seer wake up. So seer, who do you want to see tonight? Thank you. And let's have the Guami Hag, the creepy old Guami Hag. You can wake up. And if you want to, you don't have to do this. If you want to, you can send someone out. Thank you. And then let's have the Guami Wolf. The Guami Wolf, you can wake up. And do your thing, whatever it is. Thank you. Then let's have the wannabe Guami Wolf wake up and you can do your thing. Thank you. All right, finally, it's morning. Everyone wake up. Welcome to a new day. Uh, let's see here. I need to go through this in order before you unmute yourself. I need to go through a few things here. Uh, so we are going to have, okay, so Ben, uh, you have been nominated as a candidate. I'm sorry, but you are already a candidate. Uh, for the day so you guys only need to find one more that's the first news the other news is that many you have been killed by the werewolves during the night so sorry you're out and many was a villager and let's see then also Chris uh, you have been sent to some kind of spa weekend thingy so you're gone for a full day and the night so we'll see you next morning have fun i hope it's your own spa because that was really good when i was at it so that's about it now you can try to find someone else to kill as you usually do in this village because ben is already a candidate yeah i survived the first day today i, ha I have a question a rules question so when the minion if we kill the minion what will you, will you tell us when they die will you tell us the uh, minion's it's, dead? On, it's on the werewolf team Okay. So a, a minion has become a werewolf. Yeah. I would say it's a werewolf that died. It's on the werewolf team. It's a human, oh, but okay. It's, yeah. Oh, so nice. you have to say it's a werewolf. Luciana, do you have any more info? Well, um, I I only got to um um. Well, I I had to choose. Kyle, nominate. did you have that because you just became the minion? You didn't and... nominate. Okay. No, yeah. I did not uh do that because I became the minion. I am not the minion. But it, we... it makes me wonder: is um the second option kill? If I had to, if, if I have to choose nominate, is was the first option kill or the other one? No, it oh. would have been okay. um, the. No, you would have had a lot no, of other like options. Okay. Seven other options. Yeah. 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 Other options. So if yeah. Yeah. nominate, then you definitely won't have kill because he picks up two boards and kill and nominate are written on the same board, so those will never oh. be the same. Choice. Should have been yeah. C or protect or. Can you let Sean uh, let us know yeah. how the vote went or whatever he said. Yeah. Thanks, Matthew. I don't like interrupting people, so I was just going to wait till a pause happened. Um, so yeah, I got to see the vote. I was kind of surprised for the people who voted for Ben to die, especially after it was kind of cleared that he had a role and uh, Flick didn't claim a role. So anybody that uh, that voted up last time, did they want to say why they voted for Ben? I did. I voted I did. up. Yeah. I also did. Um, he has used that um, excuse more than once in many games with me. Yeah, so and he huge flawed logic in the whole it wasn't the third vote because the problem is is that yeah. if you allow i have a role and i will not share it to be a defense then werewolves uh can just say yeah. that right and, and then, i mean and he's done that before yeah so i really yeah, I've i was seen skeptical actually quite a few people say that i actually honestly thought and flick i thought had a better argument all in all even though she was a werewolf i and i will point oh, out oh, that the that out. man nominated him so a definitely a confirmed uh, villager also thought that. No. Yeah, um, I Wait. didn't actually ask this during the Q&A. I was thinking about it. Um, ben said he had a role, but did he say it was a village role? <laughs> no, he didn't. <laughs> okay, yeah, because I was like, he could say he has a role. 
<laughs> I thought, I thought and, Ben and look confident, right? Okay. I thought Ben was suspicious, but for me, it was and when Flick was giving her defense, it had nothing to do with the role. It had everything to do with the way that her voice raised when she was and kind of sped up when she was defending herself. I thought that was super suspicious. I yeah, thought she she'd come back to Ben. The other to me, thing she I just thought, sounded like she was lying. Yeah. She, the other thing had, I thought about Ben was not lying to Village, yeah. Did he have his face covered? But when it was called out, he quickly fixed that, which I feel if he wasn't a werewolf, he wouldn't have been so quick to, I don't know. That just seems suspicious to me. That, that, that is like a human, re human reflex. Like somebody says, oh, putting your face and mouth in front of you, like this is suspicious. And it just might be like a reflex to be like, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I mean, nobody wants to die on the first day of werewolf. So obviously I'm going to try and avoid suspicion that way. If somebody's I, like, calling that out, I'm going to stop doing it. And I typically don't like saying who I trust, but I 100% trust Melissa because she called out Flick. I had Flick down as suspicious. And I noticed when Flick was talking earlier in that day, I saw Melissa kind of do this bunny nose thing. Like she didn't like what Flick was saying, which I don't think she would do if she was trying to hatch a plan as a werewolf. That seems like a genuine reaction. <laughs> okay, I, to that, I will say though, one thing. Either. So I, I don't think it clears anybody at that first nomination. Whoever was suspicious of Flick, I, I'm... That doesn't clear them for me because the minion wasn't aware they were the minion. Yeah, that's, that's what I was going to yeah. say. That is, is well, the fact what, what, that we, what Daddy's the saying is that know. that Melissa is definitely not the werewolf. She could be the minion, but she's right. definitely yeah. not the werewolf oh, because right, she nominated right. Flick. I, I agree. Yeah. yeah, it was like oh, bewitched. What? Her little nose went, and she got a werewolf. <laughs> <I hope Melissa's laughs> <the trooper. laughs> It'd be great if Melissa was the trooper. Oh, that would um, be great. <laughs> I, I will ask. I will ask everyone a little favor. If I, if you get a message for me for whatever reason, uh, then please message back. Message back to say okay or something, so I know that you've seen it. Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, uh, I, I, have, I have a request, Joseph. Could you maybe uh, give us less time for the whole nomination process, but more? time after the defenses because yeah, sure. we have yeah. two defenses and it's actually the point where we get the most information because yeah, people sure. are defending for their time for their lives <laughs> yeah well but that is true because you know mo most of the stuff you're talking now is actually not so useful but after people have well, tried I, to defend I, I, themselves look, look, yeah, it's, it's up to you if you are quick if you are quick okay. with finding okay. two yeah. candidates, then I will get you, give you more time after. Okay. Yep. If you no, take that's fair. Yeah. Have, that's fair. What did you do candidate. last night, Luciana? So, uh, what? Um, what did you, I, what I had to nominate. And okay, I nominated so Ben. Okay. Yeah. So it wasn't the Guami man that nominated. It was no. the Guami yeah, wannabe. Yeah, it was okay. Luciana. So I think the Guami man protected or um, checked someone, I think. So I would yeah. say, Ben, you, you should again, have the chance to choose your opponent if you want to. I mean, uh, I, I still don't really have any strong suspicions, so I, I don't really know who, to, who else to put up. Well, well I mean, look, I, for better or worse, having suspicion on me in the first day puts me in a tough spot because I have a role that's a village role and I haven't been able to use it. So I nominate I want to use that. Alex Daly. We have a nomination for Alex. Is there a second? Why not? I want to say why. Because the thing is, I actually believe Ben. I'm sorry, but I actually believe Ben. Gualix was the one who nominated him in the yeah, but first I place, and it's been Gwalex really against. Good. And has been really against Ben. Well, you can think Alex is good. I just think that Ben is good. I believe what he's saying, and if I believe what he's saying, then I think Alex might be bad. I gave a good reason why I nominated him. Yeah. I, I do. I actually agreed with you, but I thought if I was in Ben's shoes and I had a good role, I might be that same, oh, I don't want to seem suspicious. I believe. So I believe what he's saying. He seems truthful with everything he's saying to me. So if I believe him that and you were pretty – you gave a good reason to be suspicious, but then you continued it on to today, and I do feel like – I've only played like two games with you, but I feel like you're acting a little bit different to me. Like you're not. The is other two games, of... you were way more smiley and talkative and like in the camera. And this time you're you're just a little bit more like laid back, like almost trying to go unnoticed a little bit. 
that's just the yeah. feeling I get. I from, but if... I've only played like two games with you other than this one. No, so. I don't know if growing out looks... all the information that I've been giving and nominating people is is trying to go unnoticed for sure. But, I, I, uh, I it's can... not, you're not playing like you did the other two games is all I'm saying, I guess. And so then, I do have a comment. Okay. Why? Is unrelated to, to Gwalix, which is a little confusing that all of our names are uh, I will say, I think Ben was the one that nominated Flick, and it seems unlikely that he would nominate a werewolf if he was a werewolf, because then a werewolf... No, no, it was Melissa. Oh, okay. No, Melissa didn't though. nominate No, I didn't Flick. nominate. Oh, you didn't? Oh, who nominated no. then? Trey? I traded, right? Trey, yeah. 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 Uh, I'm going to bring somebody out here. Uh, Jamie, I know I've seen you just on the message boards, but I haven't really seen or played with you at all. Uh, just what, what are you thinking right now? Uh, what am I thinking right now? Well, I've got yeah. I've got slight suspicion on Elliot just because of the, how eager he was to jump into voting, but that could just be because he didn't know how the voting was going, possibly. He seemed quite eager to kill somebody at the start there. And... Uh, what have we got? I did have Flick down because her defence seemed pretty suspect. But she's gone, and um, I don't know. That's about it, really. Thanks, Melissa thanks. also moved her hands pretty fast from my face, but we're not decided whether that's actually anything yet. But <laughs> Ben and Melissa were both pretty eager to withdraw their hands when that was noticed. Well, but I know I'm just a normal villager. No roles, just sat here observing, trying to learn what people are doing. Elliot wanted to say something earlier. Yes. Yeah, I think it. I think we've moved on in terms of our thinking. It was more uh, um, if 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 there is a, most of us are suspicious of Ben, and I'm not sure I am, but I, it was just from where the conversation was a couple of minutes ago. I was going to suggest that we may want to get on with sort of seconding someone else against them because. I don't think we're going to make a lot more progress today, is the feeling I get. Yeah. Uh, ben, I have a question to you. Is this your first what? Werewolf game? No. <laughs> He's a regular. Okay. He was, yeah. he, he was playing Werewolf when you were, whatever. I won't go there. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's a pioneer. He was playing before you were a baby dragon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I think about 80% of the time he's a werewolf, so I don't know. What? Okay, uh, if no one wants my Gwalix one, uh, Melissa, everyone seems to agree and believe in you, so why don't you tell us your suspicions again so that we can just play off you again? Um, my two biggest suspicions right now are Elliot and uh, Ayahu. Um, I just feel like Ayahu got kind of stuck on the whole, like, defending why he picked Ben and flicked, and during it, he was inadvertently defending Flick by putting more suspicion on Ben, I felt like before the nomination. So that's why I wrote him down for that. And then Elliot, I have from the first day, he made a odd comment about nominating quiet people and he asked a question about cursed and then I just, so they're on my top of my list, so. I'll nominate Ayahu. Yeah, second it. Nomination at a second for Yahoo. What? Well played. Well played. Well played. No, hey, notice, well notice Elliot was already nominated. Well, I will say, yeah, but it was a quick second. We'll, we'll get you next, yeah. Elliot. Don't think you're out of the water. Yeah, yeah you're not out of the water, but. I, deeper who seconded water. that? I, I'm going to mute everyone because we are going to, when you have, we have two candidates, we do the process, so. We're going to have Ben start his defense. You can unmute yourself and do your defense un uninterrupted. Sure. So I guess this is just continuing from yesterday. I, I mean, I started to say this earlier, but for better or worse, me having suspicious ca suspicion cast on me on the first day puts me in a tough spot where I have a village role and I haven't been able to use it to benefit the village yet. So if I want to use that role, then I have to stay alive. And in order to do that, I have to either say, well, I'm just a villager and then hope everybody believes me or say, I have a role. I'm not telling you what it is. And then hopefully I'll get to use it. So at this point, it, like the reason that I'm going that way is the last Guami village game that I played. I think it was Adam S that had to come out with his role really early on. And he was the Guami hag and then just had to send himself out every other round in order to stay in the game. 
So just coming out and saying what roles you have early on doesn't necessarily help if then you have to do everything in your power just to stay alive. So with that said, like I said, I am on the village team. So if the village team wants me to say what I am, I'll do that and just see where it goes. But so that's my reasoning. All right. So let's hear it from Ayahu or Gua Ayahu. I don't know. So, uh, uh, the, the meta in this game is, is different because obviously I take notes and uh, when, when uh, Joseph messes with the meta so much, uh, the only note I have to take is literally how I vote. So I've been much more uh, laid back. Now, the, what I do, like I, different people have different things that they focus on. Some people pay attention to who seconds. Some people pay attention to like facial expressions. What I listen to is the logic. And I picked up on the, the logic of it because I had heard many times people say, when you are nominated, and in this, every vote, is, every nomination is a third nomination uh that that you should come out with your role it was a 50 50 that he was going to die and it seemed super odd and I, and I will say that i pointed it out and i believe four people agreed so i i don't think it's crazy that i would have said that now i do think at this point when i thought well actually that's the thing his information goes back and forth i was thinking that he had nominated her i will say that i thought that that her defense was suspicious and, and i did read the thread um but i didn't feel the need to chime in there because i try to bring all the information and everybody had had brought that information so i was trying to bring the counterpoint um because you know nobody was really talking about that so uh, and i did vote for ben because that's what i thought uh i clearly was wrong I, and i i mean i i do i will say so i have played before where a a villager does come out with a role and does survive. I don't actually know why that happens. One time I survived until the very end as the Mystic Seer, which I will never understand why that happened. <laughs> so, you know. All right. So uh, we're going to do this sort of one at a time so it doesn't get total chaos. But if you want to ask a question to the candidates, you can do yeah. that. Yeah. So, Ben, because you mentioned the last game where Adam has actually had to come out with a role, which benefited the village greatly. So I ask you, please come out with your role. I'm the Guami Hag. I sent Chris out this round thinking he's going to get lots of good information. Um, he's usually really good at picking up on tells and stuff like that. So at this point, I'm either going to die tonight or I'm going to send myself out of the village and then in two rounds, I'll get to do it again. I have a question for um, Goyahu. Um, so um, my, my, my role personally is the, um, the uh, insomniac. And I was told that you took a night action. Would you like to explain that? OK, I believe that's from a different game. Oh, sorry. I'm looking at the wrong notes. Never mind. I have a question for Ayahu. <clears throat> is your role more important than the Guami hack? Yes or no? Uh, well, so the, the Guami hack is in this game more valuable than, than the regular hag. Uh, I would say the Guami hag is more important than my role. What just happened with Paul? Uh, I was looking at the wrong notes. Never mind. Wait, seriously? Because yeah. that looked really weird. Was Are you still, you were, I thought you were trying to capture him. And yeah, I actually thought so. Was. I thought no, it was like just, a... Was like, no, and y'all just sit here. It's just like, I looked at the wrong notes from another um, game, and I'm like, wait, did nobody just uh, catch any of that? I, I thought it was, well, a, well, I was think, a joke. Well, I, think, I yeah. think I have over this weekend played a game with Paul, which did include an insomniac, and there isn't an insomniac in this game. Yeah, I looked at the wrong piece oh, of paper. Somebody needs to get Paul a trash can. <laughs> yeah, they come in handy. You even have shredders now? Maybe recycle. I will say that I had a Yahoo written down in my notes as well. I don't have anything on Elliot. So do we have any more questions? Otherwise, let's go to voting. And I will mute everyone. And I am going to roll that up first of all. And we got uh, Van, or I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong, Van. Um, you get to watch during the night. Everyone else will close their eyes. If you vote up, you want to kill Ben. If you vote down, you want to kill Ayahu. And also, um, Chris, you can watch as well, even though you're away uh, from the spa. They have like big screen TV. You can watch what happens back in the village. So uh, everyone put your hand up and then you close your eyes and we'll vote 
Up for Ben, down for a Yahoo in three, two, one. And I think, uh, so now Van can uh, vote as well. Then I'll count. Uh, Graham, can you lift your hand a little bit? Thank you. Right, thank you. Everyone can uh, lower their hands. I will say that Ben also watched now. Uh, that was a mistake, uh, probably because I don't know how to pronounce Van. Uh, so Ben thought I said Ben. Wait, oh, I'm just, sorry. Yeah, uh, I thought it, you said Ben. My just bad. so everyone knows that Ben has also watched. <laughs> so, all right. So uh, the results are in. I'm sorry to say, Gua Guayahu, you are dead. Um, thank you for playing. And Ayahu uh, was a werewolf. Hey. So, you, good night, everyone. Uh, I'll mute everyone. <laughs> it's time to sleep. Um, all right, so everyone is at, is asleep. And uh, Chris is asleep as well, obviously, over at the spa, getting that massage, just you know, closing your eyes, relaxing. I don't know why I'm fantasizing about that stuff. It's kind of weird. Uh, sorry, Chris. But anyway, let's start off as we usually do with the Guami Man. So Guami Man, if you can wake up. And I'm going to give you two different options here. And it is these two, so you can choose there. You want to do that, so who do you want to do it to? Thank you. Then you can go back to sleep and we are going to have the wannabe Guami man and wake up and you have to do this. So who do you want to do that to? Thank you. Bodyguard, who do you want to protect? Thank you. And werewolves. Werewolves wake up. Who do you want to try and kill? Okay. And let's have the Gminion wake up. And who do you want to check? Right, thank you. And then let's have the Guami Cabra wake up. And who do you want to try and kill? Thank you. All right, let's have the seer wake up. Who do you want to check? Thank you. And creepy old Guami hag. Do you want to send someone out? Thank you. And let's have the Guami Wolf wake up. Who do you want to do whatever it is you're doing to? Thank you. You can go back to sleep. And let's have the wannabe Guami Wolf uh, wake up. And 
you can do your thing. Thank you. All right, so everyone can wake up and there's some news in the village. So first of all, uh, Melissa, you are dead. I'm sorry. You were killed in the night. Melissa was a villager. Then we also had... Um, yeah, nothing else happened. <laughs> okay, so uh, Chris is welcome back to the village as well. And then you can have uh, fun or whatever it is you have in this village. Okay, um, just so you guys know, I'm the priest. Uh, he let me know that Ayahu was a villager. What's wrong? Okay. Get no, no, it's, it, uh, it's, it, it's fine. It's fine. Logical classic now? palm. Another classic palm. Yeah. Classic. So, Ben, so ben so why are you in the village, the Ben? Priest yeah. role? The priest I, is basically... I tried to send uh, Melissa out. out what role they were. I, they what? I know you said that it worked well in that game for Adam to come out as the old, or as the Guami hag and it worked well for the village, but full disclosure, I was a werewolf in that game, but I felt like it was very, very inefficient because he had to send himself out every other night and he wasn't sending anybody else out to for them to get information. Well, I'm being, I'm you just... I actually was going to say that too. <laughs> I, so I agree with you and I think we all believe you now. At least I hope most of us believe you. So I'm going to nominate Gwalix Daily once again. Okay, oh. we, have, we have a nomination for Alex. Uh, uh, by the way, wait, Chris, we are missing Chris, oh, right? Hold yeah, on, hold on, I got a question. Oh, I don't know. Wait, 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 is. guys, guys. Uh, Chris, I, I asked Paul a question oh. a while ago, and I could hear. Oh, sorry, yeah. guys. I was at the spa a little too long and got nice and funny. <laughs> I got a no. question. He paid for like checker, right? Jugan mm. has yeah. a question. I have a question, my Why? I keep oh, asking. Oh, sorry, Trey. I, I asked that a minute ago. Yeah, what, what is the priest exactly? Uh, when the person gets lynched in the day, uh, I find out what they were. Okay. All right. It's from another game. So, Jugan had a question. Oh, again. It's like the Undertaker. Jugan had a question. I look yeah, Joseph, I don't have it written down and it's not in a chat that Priest is in the game. No, <laughs> it's not. I was looking it's at not the, in the game. notes again. There is no Priest. Wait. So. Oh. And who did Paul mention? I'm not really uh, class of Paul. No, no, don't, 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 Oh, I didn't even hear there was nomination. Yeah, so why, I take my why? Back, I take mine back. I take it back. Okay. Yeah, no. So, so it, Paul, the wrong stop. Again. <laughs> can, can somebody explain to me why we believe Ben now? Like, what? Oh, I, I, you weren't I'm, you supposed uh, to send yourself out? Like, I don't understand. No one else is claiming just said He said it he was. Uh, wait, aren't we supposed to be nominating Elliot? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, potentially, but wait, 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 Okay. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Jeez. You I tried to get that. Yeah. I tried to get that question out for like two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> so whoever the the Guami man is, just to mention it, that uh, maybe in the future, since Luciana has already claimed that role, that it'd be good to let her continue getting information because she can tell us. Yeah. Um, um. I want to nominate Graham. I've got some information. Which is what? I'm going to come out. I'm the seer. This game. No. I'll I don't believe you, Gwen. I don't believe uh, Elliot. So, so question then, who, who have you all seen throughout each of the days? Yeah. Um, I... Yeah, he's I taking way too long. No. <laughs> No, I'm, checking, I'm checking the notes who's which day because you're about to ask me who's which day. Because um, Graham was um, last night. Um, the night before that was Matthew, and he's good. 
the night before the first night, which um, was Chef and He's Good. Yeah, I'm. I'm so I'm you're saying little... you saw Gwehem as a werewolf? Yes, but that's why I'm the nomination that's did. Why I'm nominating him. We do have Is there likings, a nomination? But... Oh, uh, Joseph didn't notice it. No, sorry, mm -hmm. sorry, I'm into my notes. So, uh, this is getting cra crazy. Gwelliot <laughs> nominated <laughs> Gwehem. Can we change our names, Zach? <laughs> you, you, you can just call me Elliot. Yeah, yeah, El El yeah. Elliot <laughs> nominated <laughs> Graham. okay. Is there a second for that? There was. Yeah, there was. I, I just, I think you should be more careful with um, what you're saying, because we do have um, a lichen and a wolfman and so on. So I wouldn't yeah. be one hundred percent sure. The only reason I or not. The only reason or I kind of believe so, him is because there I have Graham written down. Was there a second for Graham? Yeah, I had Graham suspicious too, but uh, I'll oh, second Alan. it. Okay, yeah, so we have to. Yeah. so we have our two we candidates. We have to be fair. Yeah. What I do think is that he's not a Guami bot because he didn't do anything and he hasn't said that much. So. Okay, I'm going to <laughs> mute everyone, yeah. and we are going to have Elliot's defense first. So Elliot, you can unmute and uninterrupted do your defense. I mean, I think I've probably said just about everything. Um, day one, I was just, because I always seem to attract suspicion by about day three, I was trying to play it cool. I I made a joke about nominating the, half joke about nominating the quiet people because I forgot we had a totally different voting method this game. Um, and I've not taken pages of notes with the roles. I've just... Um, just the people I've asked about. So I think there was a big discussion about the curse and I've just played so many different variants of things I can't remember what everything does when people say some of the names of the roles. I think that, that's all all Melissa had and I think because I had a big role I got a bit nervous. All right, so let's hear it from Graham. Are, yeah, I guess for me, it's good to hear I'm a lichen and not cursed, but it makes more sense to keep the seer, so kill me. All right, is there any questions for the candidates, or should we go to voting? Uh, Elliot is lying. No. Elliot is lying. I'm the seer. And who did you check? I checked Graham night one, daily night two, and night three, I checked a werewolf. Yeah. All right, this is kind of off topic. If you have questions for the candidates. Yeah, why, why are you lying, Gwilliot? <laughs> no real reason for a seer you're, to come out you're, after You're this. lying, no, but I'm not I going to have a shouting match here. It's not okay. going to do I actually have a... good. What are you saying? A... What do you say, Gwilliot? I was saying that I believe you coming out after Elliot. So Kyle had a question? I... Yeah, I agree. I believe Lucas because Gwilliot seemed... I was kind of suspicious the entire time that's you said not, that, but uh, I'm gonna be harsh on this. That's not really a question. Uh, so it's gonna be questions to the candidates that they can answer, or you know. So uh, Pablo oh, yeah. has a question. Okay, <laughs> good. Uh, you're muted, uh, Pablo. I'm okay, muted. Right, thanks, Elliot. Who who were the who were the three people you checked again and in what days? I, I I didn't get it down here, so I'm Graham just... was last night. Um, Chef was. Um, the first one and was good. Matthew was in the middle and was good. Okay. Okay. Is there Thanks. any other questions? Otherwise, we'll go. Okay. I actually got a question. Go okay. Kyle has a question and then we go to voting. We have to have. Graham, so you're saying that your role is just villager. You're and muted. you're muted. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. It says villager, but if it were me making the game and I had all these roles with zero to three, I suspect I'm either a lichen or a cursed. So I don't know. I'm not a hunter. All right, now, uh, I'm sorry guys, but we have to move the game along. So now we're going to vote. So voting up will be for Elliot, voting down will be for Graham. I will roll it up and we have Jamie is the one. Jamie, you get to look during the night and you also get to vote after everyone else. And so um, let's uh, put the hands up, uh, close your eyes and vote up for Elliot, down for Graham in three, two, one, vote. Thank you. You can take down your hands. 
Uh, sorry to inform you, Elliot, but you have been killed by the village. Elliot was a werewolf. So, uh, good night, everyone. All right. You should always trust people coming out as seers. As I told you so many times, it's always true when people claim that. Okay, so let's get started with the Guami Man. Guami Man, wake up. I will give you two options here. And you can do one of these two. You want to do that, so who do you want to do it to? Thank you. And wannabe Guami man, you can wake up. You have to do this. So who do you want to do that to? Thank you. Bodyguard, who do you want to protect tonight? Thank you. And werewolves. Werewolves wake up. Who do you want to murderize? Or at least try. All right. Thank you. And then we're going to have the minion wake up. And who do you want to check? Thank you. And let's have the Guomi Cabra wake up. Who do you want to target? Thank you. And Seer, who do you want to check? And then we have the Guomi Hag. Do you want to send someone out? Thank you. And let's have the Guami Wolf do you do your thing. All right. And the wannabe Guami Wolf, you can do your thing. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. All right, all right, all right, all right. So, good morning, everyone. Now, stay muted because <laughs> this. This is starting to get too chaotic for my poor uh, moderator brain, but I'll try to figure it out. So let's start from the start. Uh, Van, I'm sorry, you have been killed. Uh, Van was a villager. So that's the first thing that happened. Then we keep going here. So let's see. <laughs> and... Then the Lucas, you have been sent out on that nice to that nice bar uh, that Chris was talking so you know much about. We'll see you later. And Matthew, you have been killed as well. Matthew is dead. Matthew was a werewolf. And that's everything that happened during the night. 
So, uh... You're dead, Matthew. I get to shoot somebody. Oh, you actually do. I'm sorry, I forgot about that. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, he's the hunter who get to kill someone. <laughs> if it was earlier in the game, it would have been Jugen just for fun, but it's going to be Ben. Sorry, Ben. All right, so Ben is also dead. Ben was a villager. Wow, that was a lot of death uh, happening uh, at once. All right. I, mean, I had to sleep again, night. so... Sleep again, okay. Yep. Just like to say, I apologize for eating on camera, guys. I'm trying to eat below, just not be rude that this is breakfast, so... I will also say that, you know, you need to check your messages from time to time. So, Did Elliot threw Graham Graham Graham. under the bus and Elliot was a werewolf. I thought Graham's re uh, reaction to what Elliot was accusing him of uh, was genuine, so I'm, I'm a little bit off of Graham right now. The only other suspicion I have, and I've been right with most of these, is a Yahoo flick. Uh, the only other one on my list is uh, Adam Kraft. Why? Just based on facial cues, body language, you've been doing these soothing hand motions the entire time. You look kind of uncomfortable. Haven't said much, haven't added a whole lot to the village. Well, I, I've had said stuff. I mean, I haven't added much, but that's because I don't have a role, but. And the whole it's hand motion, I did it all the time just because I have a beard, so. This isn't a nomination, I'm just throwing it out. No, 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 that's fair. Guys, if you uh, get a message so, from so me, guys, please send a message no. back saying, okay, so I know that you've seen it. Speaking of messages, um, I'm the thing that goes bump in the night, so I got to message the person. Oh, the, this joke. Chat. Come on, so, man. Um, <laughs> What's going on? Yeah, check your messages, because I messaged the person next to me on the screen. So, you know. Uh, that rules I'm question right. for Joseph. The, yeah. the Chubacabra, if all the werewolves are dead, did they start killing two villagers or just no 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 one? one just one there's no crazy robot uh pan or whatever it was that killed two <laughs> um luciana what did you do last night she said she sleeps she slept. Yeah, oh I, again I yeah again <laughs> it's okay. random okay um, does that mean the chukacabra Either um, the, the Chupacabra wolf. hit Matthew or it was the Guami the, Man. The Guami Man had to mm -hmm. kill or sleep. Right. And then werewolves took out the fan then? Guami Man didn't sleep because Luciana had to sleep. So how do, do yeah, but you had two options. He's saying yeah. the two options could have been kill and sleep. Oh, okay, okay, okay. No, no, it, they're, they're different. You don't have those options. Guami Man does. He has two options. Yeah. yeah the Guami right, Man the two options, two... but if they're on the same thing, he doesn't, he can't have those two yeah. options. Yeah, but Kill and yeah. Sleep aren't. It's they, right. they Kill are and Nominator on the same yeah. card. So. Yeah. I wonder who Lucas might have um, checked last night. Did he have any suspicions? He always has suspicions. He, he didn't, didn't tell us. Sure. He didn't tell us yet. So, yeah, yeah that's, us. that's, yeah. yeah, that's what I was trying to ask, but then I, uh, Joseph was like, only ask the people. And I was like, okay, well, then, because he shouldn't have just said there was one werewolf that I saw and not told us in case he died somehow. I mean, yeah. I wasn't buying Elliot's defense anyway, so I don't think Lucas needed to come out because it sounded really fake. Like when Yeah, Elliot he took way too long. It did sound line. really fake, but I probably would have not taken the chance to vote on him, especially Here's when the, the other person was a vill just a plain villager. So but here's the thing is with with Elliot, he's he's always got kind of a nervous energy about him. And the only reason I kind of believed him at first was just that I had Graham written down as, as you had me written down in three games and you've never been right. I was right last game. What are you talking about? You were the well, I've never had a night roll. I've never been bad. You were the the the, the person that was uh, the that we had to man. kill before the werewolves. Yeah, you were the oh, thing that we had to kill man. at yeah. that time. Yeah, that man. one. <laughs> invisible man. You were the invisible man in the game I had you written down. Oh man. That doesn't mean he was bad. He was just on his own team. <laughs> you know, he was on his own bad team. <laughs> so. Yeah. Do we think Elliot? Ever Noted two other werewolves or one werewolf and then one random? I think he probably just outed just one. Uh, that, that's, that's interesting. A classic yeah, that's a good move. suspicion. Yeah, I, I could see why. Yeah, and Elliot, <laughs> Elliot did dominate Yayahu too, which was kind of. I'm surprised he didn't bring that. I was waiting for him to bring that up in his defense, and he never did. So I was thinking was he was the Kalani wolf. Yeah. I think he was a more important werewolf than, El uh, than, uh, than uh, Yahoo. I think yeah. that's why he did it. 
good point. Good point. Just to clarify, I don't think it's Graham anymore. <laughs> I said that before. Once the fake seer called him out. <laughs> well, I don't think you would call out two werewolves necessarily. One would kind of make oh, yeah, sense. Yeah. No, I agree. With right. You. <clears throat> so. The only other thing hey, that, that gonna... kind of led me thinking that it might not be a, or Elliot was just the fact that he was still alive after Melissa had accused him. It seemed like a pretty obvious Guami Cabra pick. But, yeah, maybe so I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask suspicion. Because Melissa's gone and Lucas, whoever he tested, was not, uh, he can't tell us at this point in time. So I'm going to bring it down to Chris. Chris has not spoken at all and he usually has some crazy, wonderful insights. So what do you, what do you got for us, Chris? I was I was on vacation. <laughs> I had a nice vacation. I don't know. You're still you're still relaxed. He, he okay, didn't stay in front of the monitor. He actually went like took a nap somewhere. <laughs> yeah, I actually used that time to use the restroom. It was great. <laughs> I was I was gonna nominate wow. myself just to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Jeez, I haven't. Uh, I don't. The only person I really have played with a lot is Trey, and I don't have any suspicions on Trey. He seems pretty good. Um. Classic Paul's always quiet, but he's acting kooky. I think I got, I think he's good. I don't know. I don't know half of you. I, I saw why there was suspicion on Daily earlier, but I don't know if it's a, I'm iffy on that, I guess. That's my. Oh, Lucas opinion. cleared me. Oh, did he? See, I don't. He said I was one of the people he checked. He didn't say I was oh. a werewolf, so presumably. That's true. He did say he oh, saw a werewolf, but he didn't say who he was. No, he right. He named me, and then he said, I saw a werewolf as well. Okay. I'm surprised. I don't know why he didn't Sorry. say it. I don't remember who his first check was. He probably didn't want to out the wolf because the beta wolf could have just sacrificed that wolf. Oh, okay. Um, but he yeah. can tell if, us if there was a beta, yeah. Yeah, he yeah, can tell okay. us tomorrow. And then we can do that. And we check to make sure Beta Wolf is actually a possibility. I'm sorry, Paul, you've led me astray a couple times already. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it is. One of the one possibles. One of the possibles. Okay, I think I got, Paul I got something a where he gets told know. to do something each day. I don't know. I got a question. It's still weird. Paul. What? What percentage would you say that a Yahoo was actually a werewolf? Uh, I actually forgot. Did he, what Joseph say uh, who was? Okay, that's what I thought. Interesting. I, I, I usually write See down. What happened so, there? I don't remember. <laughs> you know, it, Tra you answered my question. You answered my question. <laughs> so, uh, oh. Jamie's mm. awful quiet, and he's just usually if quiet, I... super quiet when he's a werewolf. So he hasn't said anything. I'm, I'm I super hear quiet from... always. No, you're yes. not. He don't, called don't out a Yahoo. I play enough games with you when you. I know you're quiet. Right. When you're super quiet, you're usually a werewolf. So let me hear something. Right, well, to be fair, I did suspect Kyle when, like, when what, what was it? Hang on, because I, because Ben, I didn't trust Ben to start with, and he was sort of backing him up. So I kind of had suspicions on Kyle, but obviously Ben was a villager, so those suspicions no longer are there. Wait. Um, and the only other thing I got, obviously, Elliot was the werewolf and Chris and Jugan were the only two. Well, there was one other person, but Chris and Jugan were the only two I got noted that voted down. I'm not up, so, so that would have been to not vote for the werewolf. But Wait, can you can you repeat that? Because you saw the votes, right? And who voted who voted down on Elliot? Um Chris and Jugan are the only two that voted down. Well and there was one other person but I didn't get a chance to know him. Okay. Everybody else voted for so, so that would mean they wanted to, uh, they wanted, um, who was they wanted Elliot to stay alive, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do have the Gwoter in this game, I'll yeah. just remind people. There's that as well, yeah, yeah that, but, that is true. Yeah. Other than that, I have got nothing to go on, really. Nothing at all. If, if Daly is cleared by Lucas, who is the supposed seer. Then I would want to know just what what Kyle's thoughts are because he was going after Daly. I'm not going to nominate him, but I just want to hear what he has to say about that. I don't think Kyle's <laughs> okay, better. that's fine. Uh, no, I'm not my quote. Him. My thing on I, I I I trust that Lucas is the seer, so I don't want. That's why I didn't immediately nominate uh, Gualix, but uh, 
I still have a, I still feel like he's playing slightly different. Maybe he has a role, but there's also the Wolfman in the minion. So there's a possibility, but I don't think it's as big a possibility. So there's no reason for me to nominate him immediately. Uh, I have a small list of people I trust. Uh, Gwalex has a star by his name just because I do feel that twinge, but I trust Pablo. I trust uh, Paul and I trust uh, uh, Lucia. Sienna, uh, I'm sorry, I'm <laughs> Luciana? destroying your name. No, no, it's okay. <laughs> Luciana. Yeah. Uh, but like obviously, everyone probably should be trusting Luciana at this point. So, uh, and then I, I, I kind of trust Trey too. So I guess those are my five people I kind of trust. There's two people with stars by their names, but for the most part, those are the people I trust. Well, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, nominate Adam Kraft then. So I'll we have a nomination it. for Adam. Is there a second? second There's a second. We have a first candidate. We're looking for a, for another candidate. So clarification on the minion: Are do they start killing people with the other werewolf? Like, are they actually just a werewolf, or are they a villager who's helping the no. werewolf? So they the are they are a villager who's helping the werewolf. So, okay. so they don't have they don't have any killing power. The only thing they can do at night is just look for trade us. people. So basically, if the werewolves are dead, uh, the minion has to win by himself by voting people out, right? No, if all the werewolves are dead and the Guamacabra are dead, the village wins. Even if the minion's still alive? Yeah, yeah, the, the, yeah minion the minion doesn't count in that sense. It's like, it's it's a villager, okay. but it's like, yeah. Okay. It's a bit complicated, I know, but I'm making stuff up here, so. <laughs> Clearly, I'm just hey, we're, it just, he's making up the game as we go. We're good. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm doing the same thing that Tom did. That, when... that, that, that would explain that's Paul if that's the case. <laughs> I, I, I have uh, the same people on my list, four. by the way, in case I die. <laughs> uh, Sean, you want to talk up a little bit? You haven't talked a whole lot, and you're not on my list of trustworthy people, so. No, just, yeah, no, it's up. fine. It's a... um, I am. A villager. Uh, I am inclined to trust Jamie. I've played with him a couple times, and <clears throat> I'm usually impressed how good he is. Um, caught me off guard the first time we played, so uh, his instincts I trust. Um, I think the thing between Gwalix and Kyle, I see it most times where two villagers get some suspicion on each other, and they just spend the whole game going after each other for no real reason other than that that first day. So. Um, Right, from my point of view, I don't see either one of you doing anything that's suspicious, if that helps you at all. Uh, to be fair, people... I'm, I'm not going after Kyle. I think right, right. Yeah. yeah. I think um, he's just got a terrible, terrible read. So the people that I, I am just was suspicious... going. Uh, the the yeah, people I am ahead. suspicious of would be Trey, um, only because I haven't played with him a whole lot, and I usually see him uh, participate a lot more, but it, it also. I do notice you, it seems like you're having some conversations in the background. You'll, you'll mute and like take a earphone off or something. It sounds like you have my wife and my off. daughter in here, but no, I'll tell you yeah. what, there, there are so many freaky things going on. I have no unearthly idea what the heck is happening. <laughs> that's the legit truth. Fair. There's like 18 I mean, I, I don't have, I mean, <laughs> even with the rules explanation, there was stuff that's crossing and, and things that could happen. And I'm, I'm literally to the point where I, I have no clue what's going on. Plus, most of y'all I haven't played with, so it's hard for me to read you. The only things I've done in this game so far was go after Melissa's reads. Yeah, and obviously I trust um, Luciana. Uh, Paul, I, I don't know. I, I was really suspicious of you at first. I'm just wondering if you want to claim a role or anything this round. Uh, no, I already said that I was the. Uh, uh, what did I say I was? A priest. Oh, the thing that goes bump in the All night. Right. Okay, yeah, priest thing that goes bump in the night. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. He's the, he's the um, amnesiac. That's what he is. <laughs> and then just going down the list, like Pablo. I don't. I don't know. Oh, Guami. <laughs> okay. I have a. I have a question. I don't remember who was the first person that got to keep their eyes open on the first day. No, Sean. Because I, oh, for the vote. Yeah. Yeah, I got to see the first vote. Who Who voted for Ben? Because that's kind of the people who have been going after, <laughs> especially after Ayahu was. I wrote down Ayahu Matthew. We're all trying to get on Ben. I voted Ben. So I yeah, voted Ben, me, and me I told too. you why. <laughs> yeah, everyone said that next day. Um, yeah. I'll, I'll okay. be honest here that when – and this happened to me the last time that we did this. 
and, and you also kind of threw another curveball in there where you vote after. So I was trying mm -hmm. to figure out, it looked like, um, like Flick had the majority of votes. So I was trying to figure out who voted for Ben. By the time I got to that point, I'm like, man, this clock is ticking. And I don't know if it's like bending the rules for me to taking this much time taking notes. So I just went ahead and, and threw my vote, tried to capture the rest I could. So but I, did, I didn't get everybody. Yeah. I did save. I did save him the next time. I voted, you know, with the other person. What was it? I can't remember who we went up against the second. A day. Yahoo. A yeah. Yahoo. Yeah. yeah, I voted against. I voted down for a Yahoo. Yeah, his yeah. defense was way Same. too much. I just after that day, he gave me that confidence to say, "All right, I trust him." You know, after yeah. all the talk. So. Yeah, and what he claimed but, Guami man, uh, Guami hack, and I, I, I'd rather not kill Guami hack. <laughs> yeah, and no one counter claimed it either. That's kind of what I've been going on in this game, and that's one of the reasons I was kind of against Gualix at the beginning. Um, Do we, we already have a nomination today, or is it still? Yeah, yeah add them the stuff open? on the chopping block. We need another one, and actually, we need it pretty soon. Well, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna continue doing my game plan then, even though I think I believe you, Chef. I'm gonna nominate Chef. Okay. Chef Don't has been nominated. Second. Is there a second for Chef? Don't second it. We have Gu yeah, Graham seconding. He was already second. So I don't know if yeah. All right, so we have our two candidates and. We're going to do a really quick uh, Q&A here, uh, so if there's any questions... Uh, no, we should do the defense first, actually. So let's have Adam do his defense first, and uh, nobody interrupt him. So, Adam. Um, well, Alex was right, and I haven't contributed too much, other than I did vote with the majority on a few werewolf kills, but I haven't contributed too much because I've... I'm just a villager. I don't have any particular role. So <laughs> in perfect honesty, losing me is not the worst thing to happen to the village as much as I don't want to die and survive to the end. It's I got I got uh, really nothing other than that. I think Alex mentioned something about I keep doing hand motions or something. I, I just always do that, especially if I'm just sitting in one spot for a while. But um, I thought I was acting the same throughout the whole game, but I don't know. Yeah, probably should have a better defense in this immediately, but I really just don't have anything. I'm sorry. Um, if I had to throw out any suspicions, which immediately they're sketchy at best, maybe Jamie, and I don't really have a good basis for that, to be honest. You, I've seen you be quiet, but you're a little bit more quiet than I saw you last time I played with you, but that's not really much immediately. And maybe Jugen, just because he seems literally and figuratively very laid back and trying to blend in the background, but Again, I'm throwing out some sketch, uh, some weak stuff, so take that as you will. All right, so, Chef, it's your time on the floor. Um, yeah, so, guys, uh, yeah, you want to keep me around. Uh, you know, I'm going to benefit the village. Uh, I will benefit the village throughout this game. Uh, I will tell you that. Uh, uh, I am definitely on the village's team. I will absolutely help us out, um, beat these werewolves, and eliminate them and take them out by the end. All right. That was no, that, no, no. that that was uh, defenses. So, now uh, any questions really quick or we go to voting. Yeah, I have one if, if it's okay. I know I just talked for a whole bit, but chef uh, at this point, especially since my neck is on the line, what is your role if 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 it's more important for me to die than you? I didn't actually technically say I had a role. I implied it and uh, well, let's they, just say yeah, you want to keep me around. Important. No, well, let's just are, say you need to keep me around. There are rules that you. And if you're on the village team, you would you would you would want to keep me around. I. Well, I guess my question to that is: we are getting to the end. We've killed a lot of werewolves, and we already have the seer come out. So you're implying one role. If you're not willing to say it, uh, I just I, don't I, let you. No, just let you know. I'm going to call Bill Belichick. You want to keep me around? <laughs> if anyone knows what <laughs> Bill Belichick is for football, some people don't like Bill Belichick. Okay. So I'm cutting you off there, and let's go to the voting. And uh, Gualex is ready, obviously. All right, so we are going to vote uh, up to kill Adam, down to kill Chef. And I'm going to roll it up, and it's going to be... Uh, Lucas is not here, so I'll go one step down. So it's going to be Alex who gets to watch and vote after everyone else. So everyone else except Alex, uh, close your eyes. And vote up for Adam, down for Chef in three, two, one. 
and now Alex can vote. Thank you, you can take down your hands. And I am sorry to uh, tell you, but Adam, you have been killed by the village. Adam was a villager. So, good night, everyone. Okay, so let me see. We start off as we usually do with the Guami Man. So, Guami Man, you can wake up. And I'm going to put these out here. So you have these two to choose between. You want to do that. So who do you want to do it to? Thank you. You can go back to sleep and we're going to have the wannabe Guami man wake up. And you have to do this. So who do you want to do that to? Thank you. Bodyguard. Who do you want to protect tonight? Bodyguard. Thank you. Werewolves. Werewolves wake up. So who do you want to kill? Okay. Then let's have the minion wake up. And who do you want to check? And Guamicabra, who do you want to try and kill? Thank you. Then Seer, who do you want to see? All right, thank you. Guami Hag, Guami Hag, who do you want to send, or do you want to send someone out? Okay. And Guami Wolf, do you want to do your thing? All right, thank you. And Wannabe Guami Wolf, what will you do with your thing that you do? Thank you. All right, so uh, everyone can wake up. It's morning, but don't unmute yourself yet. Uh, we will also say welcome back to Lucas. And we're going to go over a few things here. So first of all, uh, let's see. Pablo, you are dead. Pablo was a villager. Then also nothing else happened. So uh, yeah, day five. Let's find some candidates. Lucas, my boy. Lucas, who was the that other Luke? werewolf? Matthew was it. Okay. Who? Matthew. Oh, okay. oh, oh. Um, that's interesting because I had the kill option and I um, chose chef. <laughs> because yeah. I thought that maybe he is going to be the one targeted. Or, yeah, I, I'm not sure, but I, I'm glad you're not 
that because I actually didn't want to. <laughs> what? But, well, so, I had I had to because um, Adam G was obviously a, a villager, and that's the okay. only thing I I could go on. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! So, what wasn't Tough Wolf one of the options though? Yeah, one of the options, but there's so another option. That's also an option. Oh. Yeah. Yes. And he, he can't say what he it is if that was what he was. Yeah. Been, like, Lucinia, I'm just really disappointed in you. It also been the so bodyguard. Sorry. You're right. No, like, but, like but I am, I'm, I, I am like, <laughs> ulti- like fundamentally disappointed. Yeah, <laughs> I know, because you were also <laughs> the only one who kept asking me what I did, and I, I'm well, not gonna say more because. But why did I you thought, choose chef then? Wait, wait, because wait. Because so. I, I, I had this slight suspicion that he might be alive, even though I picked him. He did talk about Bill Belichick, so he could be. That, that, I, I, that, that would be the only reason why you should have killed me. <laughs> By the way, I want to clarify something. I want to clarify something. I'm a New York Giants fan. I do not like the Patriots. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I knew that. These references are so, like flowing over my head. I don't understand them. So you might be cheating. Me, I don't know. I would definitely no. target you. <laughs> it's funny you should mention cheating when we're talking about Bill Bud. Right, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Can we say deflate gate? Uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, classic Paul. I feel oh, wait, right right never now. mind. I, I have an idea. Okay. Oh, Paul, do you, do you want to claim something? Uh, yeah, I'm unfortunately the Time Lord, so I'll only win if the timer hits zero three times, and you guys haven't managed <laughs> it zero once. So I, guess I, it I love it. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> what if he's not, he's not a, if he's not a guami like, bot, he's doing oh a great Oh, my job. God. Hey, hey, Lucas, can you tell us who you oh, check? Sure. Uh, I couldn't check anyone because I no, was. No, but how about two nights ago? Night, though. How about two nights ago? Yeah. Yeah, you saw uh, the votes, right? Yeah. Oh. I checked someone. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> hey, Jeff, <laughs> he's, if he's not telling, there's a reason. So. Yep. Do what? I said if he's not telling, there's a reason for it. Oh, hey, well, he, he can only know if they're a werewolf or not a werewolf. So. <laughs> Yeah. Wait, Lucas? I got you, Lucas. I got yeah, you. Sure, sure. Sorry, sorry, I was talking to my wife. I didn't hear what Lucas said. Uh, I, I, t- I checked he someone, said, but I'm not like telling you. like three people talking, guys. I cannot yeah. hear everybody. That's the problem. I checked someone, but I'm not telling. Okay, so, okay. Now, I do have something that is weird about what Luciana said about Chef. And Chef really went hard on the fact that he's got a role and that we shouldn't kill him. And then Luciana tried to kill him and he didn't die. Yeah. So, are we all thinking what I'm thinking? Body Probably what are you two, two, three. Well, options. There, are three options, there are three options. Yeah, there are three options. Yep. But we should I'm, not tell. Yeah, but, but I've been that robot. No, no, we should tell because that guy is not good for both sides. What? Oh, now I'm. Now I feel. No, 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 no. He's not a chupacabra. Chupacabra oh, he could be killed by werewolves. Yeah, yeah. no, the chupacabra would have died if she. Yeah. Oh, that's right. They can only die to werewolves. I mean, I mean, yeah. there are three options. Die to werewolves. One uh, option is no, no. Yeah. My bad, my bad. I yeah. was thinking you can't die. He can't die at night. You but there's still three options. Yeah. No, 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 Either he was cool. protected cool. by cool. the bodyguard. You, know, you yeah. don't have to go over all the options. Yeah. I'm just wrong. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm good. Stop you there. Don't say anymore. Stop. I just want to ask someone. No, okay. No, 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 no. Uh, you know the the the, the day I, I came out as a seer and said I found a werewolf. Did anyone find someone suspicious, nervous? Because that's the reason I did it. You, because you didn't actually tell us. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, I did. I didn't. I was looking. I was looking at other screens. I just didn't see. Because I played with you enough times, knowing you do stuff like that. So as soon as you said that, I was like looking around crazy at other screens. I didn't see nothing. Yep. I, I might not caught it. I don't know if you did. No, I didn't catch anything. Yeah. yeah. Chris, did you find gamer. someone? Nobody I'm alive, st- anyways. I'm so, still, I, I'm still and, on Jamie. And, and most of these people, to be fair, I haven't played with before. I've played with like uh, three of you, enough. But I, I feel like the three are Paul, who I feel is good. I think I know what he. Yeah, I think he's I know what out. He's, he's in outer space, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then Trey and Lucas, and I think all three of you haven't given me anything to worry about at this point. I'm still on Jamie. He's still too quiet. I nominate Jamie. I'll second it. Okay, so there was a nomination a second for Jamie, right? Yep. All right, so we have our first candidate. 
We're looking for a second one. Yeah, let me nominate. Lucas, you said you want to nominate. I was about to say, yep. you got to do it. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, no, I, I'm just writing down. <laughs> oh, who no, okay. <laughs> we're wait, we're nominate. waiting a bit of breath. I nominate Chris. Suspense. Chris has been nominated. Is there a second for Chris? I'll second. second. Did you see Chris? Hey, second. Hey, if Lucas nominates. Lucas, did you see Chris? Okay. Yep. Yep. Oh, okay. Then Enough tell us. Me. We'll vote. <laughs> no, no. Uh, All right. So it's time for Jamie's defense. So Jamie, you can unmute yourself and uninterrupt the defense. So I reckon he's only calling me out because I said he voted down on to save Elliot. I see anything I can think of, really. I don't reckon I'm being any less quiet. I think I'd probably be more talking of this game than any other game. So I think he's in werewolf wise. I'm a bit more talkative in Blood of the Clock Tower, for sure. But I reckon that's it. It's just because I said he voted down. But I've got no other suspicions right now. That's all. All right, so let's have Chris defend himself. Hello, everybody. It's just me, the one Lucas is trying to murder. <laughs> I'm I'm innocent. I'm just a plain old villager. I have nothing to do. No, I must be a lichen, I'm assuming. But I don't know. Like I said, I have no real suspicions, and I just like to... I'll, I'll keep an eye out while I'm dead. And um, if we play with some of you again, I'll... I'll hopefully have a better idea of how many of you lie and what you do. So good luck to you. But you should probably kill me because if I'm a lichen, you'll never trust me anyways. So that's fine. Well, Chris, <laughs> you, you're you're right. You are a horrible werewolf. I am. You really are because I know you from Blood of the Clock Tower. That was horrible. What are you talking about? That was my usual speech. <laughs> All right. Is there any questions no, for wasn't. the... That was like I got caught. Is, you know there, any, is there any questions right. regarding... Trace evil. I'm the werewolf, and Trey is my buddy. Kill him next. Take him out. <laughs> what? Nobody's going to believe uh, me. <laughs> I have a question for Jamie. Okay, we have what a question for Jamie. Yeah. You said this? Who, who am I talking to? I, Kyle, what is your what? role? Uh, so I'm just a, literally just a villager. No, I haven't got any role at all. Okay. I have a question for Chris. Yes, Lucas. Uh, who do you think is the Chupacabra? Is it Kyle? Because he has, he is high on my suspicion list as a chupacabra. Well, he didn't try to eat me yet, I'm, since I'm a werewolf, obviously. <laughs> and we're going to kill him. <laughs> I didn't know the chupacabra ate anybody. Don't they eat people at night? I don't know. I have no they idea only eat the werewolves. Is. I don't know. I th It sounded like Chef to me, but it could have been Kyle. I really wish I played with some of you more. I'm going to go with Chef or Kyle. Is a chupacabra. Can't okay, thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Have a nice day. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, Except for trying to murder I, me, so that's I, not very nice. <laughs> I can't. I can't listen to more of this without starting to laugh. So let's go to the vote. Uh, so it's going to be up for Jamie and down for Chris. Uh, I'm gonna roll it up, and we have uh, Sean. You get to watch and vote after where everyone else. So everyone except Sean, close your eyes. And vote for up for Jamie, down for Chris in three, two, one. Thank you. You can pull down your hands. And I am sorry to say, Chris, you are dead. The village chose to kill you. And uh, yeah, Chris was a werewolf. I, I, I've been waiting to say that like the whole game. You are horrible, Chris. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that once in a lifetime opportunity, Yosef, I as did. I die. I, I did. I really enjoyed it. All right. So good night, everyone. It is random. It is random. All right. So um, we go to the night here. And let's see. I need to update my notes a little bit. And now we are going to start with the Guami Man. So Guami Man, who, let's see, I'm going to show you two things. And you want to do that, okay. Uh, so who do you want to do it to? So 
Thank you. All right, so let's have the wannabe Guami man wake up. And wannabe Guami man, you have to do this. So who do you want to do that to? Thank you. Uh, bodyguard, who do you want to protect? Thank you. Werewolves, who do you want to kill? Okay. Then we're going to have the minion wake up and look for someone. All right. And then we're going to have the Guamicabra. Thank you. Then we're going to have the seer wake up. So who do you want to check? Thank you. And creepy old Guami Hag. Do you want to send someone out? Thank you. Then the uh, Guami Wolf. Do you want to do your thing? Okay. You can go back to sleep and let's have the wannabe Guami Wolf. You can do your thing that you usually do. Thank you. All right. So everyone can wake up. This was a, uh, I was almost going to say good morning, but I'm not going to say it because uh, I don't you know. This was a really bloody night here. Uh, well, first of all, Kyle is dead, and Kyle is the hunter, so Kyle, you get to take someone with you. Um, uh, um, sorry. No, 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 no input, no, 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 I'm asking you, I'm asking you, Joseph, shouldn't you tell Kyle who also died? Okay. Maybe I should. Okay, thank you, Lucas. <laughs> okay, no, no input now, guys. Okay, so, uh, okay, well, let's start in the other direction then. So let's start with uh, Jamie. You are dead, and Jamie was a werewolf. Then we're gonna. I'm gonna say, um, Alex, you are dead, and Alex was a villager. And then Kyle, you are dead, and you're the hunter, so you can take someone with you. <laughs> that was actually good, Lucas. <laughs> okay, so. I'm gonna uh, shoot uh, Jugan. Jugan is dead. Jugan was a villager. Wow. Okay, my notes are messed up now. Um, what was that? Four people died. Uh, also, also, uh, Chef, you are silenced, so you can't talk today. So uh, yeah, <laughs> day number six begins. <laughs> I was actually thinking that exact same thing, but I was like, do I interrupt? I don't know what to do. And then I thought, maybe. Uh, yeah. yeah, 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 it made sense. I... <laughs> yeah. 
Luciana, do you want to let us I'm know? I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I had to silence somebody. And since we kind Are of... Are you guys doing a bath? No, that... No. Well, at least I... <laughs> yeah. Okay. I mean, that explains everything. I think he's good. So I, I thought I'd rather silence someone who we... Or who I at least feel like he's 100% good. Yeah. Good. Sorry, Sha. <laughs> Lucas, do you have any information? Not really, no. What I'm hoping for is that I hope the werewolves target me because I'm the uh, diseased. So if they do <laughs> kill me, they won't get it killed <laughs> the next year. <laughs> <laughs> I like how Paul is, keeps doing it with a straight face, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At first, he was so confused. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> Can we go over the scenarios where there would be three kills? We got a Chubacabra death. Presumably a Guami yeah. man kill and a werewolf. Werewolf kill. kill, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it was a wolf Screams. cup. That means the. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. Chris yeah. could have been wolf cup. Yeah. If the Guami man is still alive, then they should come out too because. Actually, every but villager role should come out dead. now. I'm the wannabe Guami man. Yeah. <laughs> I'm yeah. The, I'm the diseased. <laughs> yeah, we know what you are for. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Graham, Sean and Trey you want to claim anything? I've already come out I'm a, a villager that if if you saw me and I was good then I'm probably cursed so if there's a werewolf left in the game and they kill me nobody dies at night then you should kill me after that but at this point I'm still a villager and I suspect all the werewolves are dead I'm I'm suspicious of Trey and it wasn't the, that first day where I said that you're not really playing the way I, I normally see you play, which made me kind of suspicious of you. And you said that you were just lost in it. And I, I, I believed it. And then I, the way my mind works, I like process stuff while I'm sitting there sleeping. And uh, at the, the, like yesterday I woke up and I was like, wait a minute, you play Blood on the Clock Tower. And that's way more challenging than this. And you're really good at that. I don't think that these roles are should be that actually. Difficult to keep if track you of. really talk to people, I'm really not. I'm the guy that people seek out and go get information because I'm gullible. I'm actually really bad at blood on the clock tower. Uh, okay, well, actually, I really I'm, am. I'm, I'm just Sean, surprised. I don't I think this you, is no, that no, complicated. No, Sean. Here's the deal: is I just as Chris said, I I know like three of you guys. I I know very. I know Paul. Paul's the only person, and Chef. I played, but I've only played two games with Chef. Sean, I've played two games with you. I don't think yeah. I've ever played a game with Lu Lucas. Never played a game with Luciana. Graham, I play. I think I met you last night, maybe. Maybe that's it. Um, and the amount of roles in this game, even for me playing Blood on the Clock Tower, I'm the guy in Blood on the Clock Tower that has the sheet up the whole time. And I don't even have a sheet here to look and reference. I am confused as all get out. But I will, will tell you that I will not play my role. Uh, Lucas, what how many people part? do you check that are still alive? Uh, because you checked someone last night. Yeah, two, two of who are checked. Are and still they're both alive. villagers, I take it. Or? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I also think so we are out of like werewolves. Narrow it down. Well, no, no is, I think we are out of werewolves. If he says, I guess he wouldn't be told who the chupacabra is. That's true. Yeah, pretty yeah. sure Joseph won't tell me. So, oh, sorry, Luciana was about to say something. I think. Yeah, I, I was just uh, going to say, say that um, Lucas maybe sh should not um, tell us because uh, if we clear someone 100%, even though that could be a no, no, movement no. or a cost yeah. or so on, yeah, we, we, we need to consider I, that. I nominate yeah. Sean. We have a nomination for Sean. Is there a second? I'll second. It, I a second? I, I'm, I'm doing the nomination not as a CS. I'm doing it as a oh, player. Okay. <laughs> I thought maybe you checked them and you were just revealing it. <laughs> oh, no. I, I don't think we have werewolves left. How many did we kill? We killed like six, right? Yeah, we killed six werewolves. So, and we don't think any of them could have turned either because we, we had a kill every night. So it wasn't no, like I think there was cursed. one night with no kill. Was I think that? there was one night. If there was but like 20. I am also writing nothing down because I am lost in <laughs> out. What needs to happen for an um, for a knight to have no kills? The chubacabra has to be wrong. The werewolf has werewolves have to target somebody who's either protected or cursed. 
Um, oh yeah, yeah. And the Guami and runner up wouldn't have got the appeal. Killed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I usually okay. write down okay. who the werewolves are as they die, but I actually haven't this time. But if there were six of them, that yeah. sounds like it six. should be all of them because there's only like 21 or 22 of us who started. Given the roles at the start, I assumed there'd be few uh, werewolves. With Me uh, too. Curse. Joseph is evil. He's <laughs> yeah. so evil. You know, we, we killed a werewolf every day, I think. Or almost every day. And we still, we still haven't now, won. Can I ask a really dumb question? Why is Lucas still alive? Well, because the first night and I was I don't probably... Mean, and I don't mean that because I'm doubting you as the seer. I'm, I'm asking because I think the werewolves are idiots. No, no, they couldn't, they, they couldn't kill me because first Why? night probably I was protected by the bodyguard. Then Ben okay. sent me out, so but, I was protected but, for but, the next... But other people were dying, Lucas. They didn't pick you. Like they haven't picked you. It's not like they came back and like nobody yeah, died. They only they're had one night. You. They only okay. had one night to he, he, pick no, they've me. Had like, they've had like three. I had no, the exact no. same thought as Trey, but I didn't bring it up because Lucas came out as the seer to contradict And then he Elliot, was sent out was and then he came back for the next two. But he, he, he did it to contradict Elliot, who was also lying about seer. So that means he would have had to throw out another werewolf and say, you're not the seer. <clears> but am. the werewolves could have killed him on the night that... Th that night, and then he was sent out to the village, so they couldn't kill him that night. But yeah, but I, I think that night. Then. I think I, that like, night I was protected the by the bodyguard. Doing? No, I no, know. I think that night I was protected by the bodyguard because I came out and I confirmed Elliot as a werewolf. But there was still a villager that died. Do we That's still have true. a bodyguard? I, that I don't know. I'm, I'm, just, not, I'm just wondering why. I think the Daily was like the, never picked the yeah. seer. I think Daily yeah. was the bodyguard. You think who? Daily, Alex <laughs> Daily. Oh, okay. Do you think we're up against a chupacabra? And does the minion count as part nope. of the werewolf team? No. 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 Okay. So there has to be a werewolf. Okay. They still, the werewolves just lose. No, but if, if, just to clarify, if all the werewolves are dead, you still have to kill the, the, the guamacabra yeah, yeah. to win. It's guamacabra. Oh, I was almost about to say chupacabra, but that's another role. <laughs> <laughs> in another village. Yeah, it's not in the game. So. So oh, I will say that <clears throat> I'm, I, I always second guess myself on these things. I'm terrible uh, when it gets down to this. But Paul, I had you cleared because of how you were playing, but that's also a really good and obvious cover. So that I, I don't know. That that that's one of those that kind of makes it hard to believe. I would think it would be a little more subtle than what you've been doing, but I don't know. I mean that. Joseph May has been having a bunch of fun. I, don't... I, I have to nominate, like for me, I I don't think it's the person who's come out as the seer. I don't think it's the person who's come out as the wannabe. I don't think it's the person who silenced, and I don't think it's Paul. So the only two people left that I'm willing to vote for are Trey and Sean. Well, I think uh, you should put us up then. I'll nominate you know, Trey. I nominate whichever okay, one so has we have a nomination say, for Trey. And, that, and that's fine. I got a question though. Luciana said that she tried to target Chef. What, in what world could he have been that the curse did not known and turned? Uh, the baby dragon. Oh, I keep, I keep, I keep thinking about the werewolves. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's a, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, no, I just didn't want to say because, you know, the less. If you hit him as the curse, he he would have just died because you're not a werewolf. Okay, I get it. So there was no second for Trey, or? Yeah, no, if not, I nominate Trey. Okay, I'll, new I'll nomination for Trey. I'll second it. Okay, now we have a second. Okay, so now we have our two candidates. And we're going to start with Sean's defense. All right, I am a villager. Um, I'm trying to piece this together and see who, what scenario, because I think, I think somebody that we have trusted from the beginning isn't actually trustworthy anymore. I think maybe someone was turned as the minion. I don't know. Things that don't make sense is why Lucas and Luciana are both still alive. Lucas the seer, Luciana being the wannabe Guanami man has not been targeted at all. And at first I thought that it was because the werewolves were playing really smart and going after people that claimed that they were just a villager to try to find some curse to turn them. But this late in the game, I, I don't understand why people with those strong powers are still alive. Um, that right. That's kind of where I'm at. So I don't know. Vote for me if you want to. I'm on the village team. All right. 
So, Trey, what's your defense? Oh, can I say one more thing? Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. One, one other suspicion is that uh, when Chris usually, he always does those mind games, and he'll tell us the entire scenario and everything he knows, but he'll say it sarcastically, like, oh, well, you caught me. Here's everything I know. And when he did that, saying that he and Trey were both werewolves, that instantly made me suspicious of Trey just because it, it seemed like it was one of did those. Did he say that? I did hear him say that. Yeah, he's like, he's like oh. yeah, I'm a werewolf, and, and Trey's a werewolf werewolf with me and so that that made me think it was you because it was just so it, it seemed like a very Chris thing to do. okay I think it's time for Trey to have his defense my defense is going to be quick my defense is the fact that I'm not going to tell you what role I am but if my wife was here maybe she could tell you what role I am okay yep. is there any questions for the candidates I think we will go to voting Chef has a question, Chef. but, you know, <laughs> that's not going to work. All right, so uh, I am going to roll it up. And that means that Lucas is the one who gets to see and vote after everyone else. Everyone else, close your eyes and vote up for Sean, down for Trey. In three, two, one, vote. So we have, okay, everyone can uh, lower their hands and I'm sorry to say Sean, but you have been killed and Sean was a villager. So good night everyone. And let's see here. Okay, so we're going to start off with the Guami man. So you will get these two thingies. Okay. So who do you want to do that to? All right. And then we are going to have the wannabe. Guami man, wake up. The wannabe Guami man, you have to do this. So who do you want to do that to? Okay, thank you. Bodyguard, wake up. Who do you want to protect? Thank you. Werewolves, wake up. Who do you want to try and kill? Thank you. And Minion, who do you want to check? Minion, who do you want to look at? Thank you. And uh, Gormacabra. Thank you. Seer, who do you want to see? All right. Creepy old Guami Hag. Do you want to send someone out? Thank you. Guami Wolf, do you want to do your thing, whatever it is you're doing? Thank you. And Wannabe Guami Wolf, do you want to do your thing? 
Okay, so everyone can wake up. Good morning. Well, it's not a good morning for everyone because uh, Lucas, you were killed in the night. Lucas was a villager. So, did we have a werewolf hunter come out? Yeah, Matthew. A nomination. Okay. We have a nomination for Trey. I will do seconds the whole way down to three because we have this nomination system, by the way. So we need a, uh, is there a second for Trey? I can get my wife to come down here and second me. Mariana, do you want to come down here and second me? <laughs> I, I think yeah. either either he's the gloater I haven't been, I don't know if he's going up or down, or he's the uh, baby dragon, in which case he has two lives. If he is the baby dragon, then that would tell us that uh, Chef isn't, and there's another reason he didn't die at night. But so wait, I think it'd be useful to to try and kill him and see what happens. I, I don't. Think somebody who doesn't get it to choose how they vote isn't going to help us, and there's only two roles that can't come out. Well, I'm I don't not, think I'm Trey the is the baby dragon, though. Okay, I, listen. All right, so f real quick, I, I, I'm sorry, <laughs> I was silenced yesterday. One, you went after me. Two, you silenced me. And the only reason you silenced me is because you knew I was going to come after you. Ooh. Okay, I don't. Luciana. No, no. <laughs> I, listen, oh, 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 I, listen. I don't know if she is the trooper. I don't think so. I, I have a weird thing. I think she's the minion. I think it was one of those roles. She came out. She didn't right. But a minion against the village right now is is, is, is really hurting us. But here's the thing: we I think we have either a troop, yeah, a chupacabra or a werewolf left. I don't think it's a werewolf. I think it's chupacabra. Okay. So I think we have to find that. But I was dying to say that all last turn. So, anyways, so I just want to say it. the the <laughs> reason why why I picked you twice was because I suspected that you were the baby dragon, and that's why also why I silenced you because that makes you one hundred percent good. And I'd rather I'd rather listen to people I don't know about. Um, and if you, I I I actually think you are the baby dragon, and I'd rather kill you once instead of a villager getting rid of a villager so because we don't. Sorry, yeah, go ahead. I'm just saying, if you think he's yeah. the baby dragon, then Trey can't be the baby dragon, but he's pretending. That's what I what I was gonna say. I don't think Trey's the and baby I, dragon. I think Chef is the baby dragon. And I don't oh, think no. we should go I after mean, I'll Lucina. just tell you, I'm not the baby dragon. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't think we go after Lucini. I just needed to say that because I was gonna say that last time. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> I, I still, I still feel so bad because you're good. I, I mean, I trust you, and I, um, I'm. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm very sure you're the baby dragon. That's why I picked you, and that's why I silenced you because you're 100% good. So, uh, what do you guys think about Paul being so over the top of well, these little quarks? Well, I can answer that actually because I'm the mummy. Um, but I don't remember what the mummy does, so I just haven't <laughs> no. been doing anything. Well, what, is it is it <laughs> on, is it because he has to? Is it on purpose to protect what he's at? Right. Yeah, he, I mean, I he could I'm hide in... behind all of that. It's it's right. very so. And, and Paul's a, Paul's smart Paul, enough to do so. that. Yeah. Graham, did you come I... out with what you are? Because I never heard that. Yeah, I'm, I'm a villager, probably a cursed one, but I haven't been turned. So. Okay. Uh. Oh, see, that's right. Cursed your... don't know that they're cursed. What was your? Yeah, that's action? my point. Right. Okay. Uh, I protected myself. Just, you know. So I, but, I'm th but yeah. wouldn't that be the perfect thing for the chupacabra to be like, hey, I'm a, just a villager and I'm probably cursed? Maybe. I, I mean, I, like back when I was nominated, I was totally ready to die when I actually believed Elliot was the seer. So ever since Lucas came out and confirmed that he was lying, that I, I was pretty confident that gave people assurance that I was actually a villager. Yeah, I, my, my suspicions right now is going to Paul and Trey. I so actually believe the thought guy that... who claims that this is just a villager. Just throughout the gameplay, just just to, this is based off gameplay. That's... So but the, I could the be wrong. I mean, two people where I um, where I think they are good is is actually Paul and Chef. <clears throat> then great. So again, I nominate Trey. Okay, so we have a nomination for Trey. Is there a second? I'll nominate myself first if somebody okay. wants I'll to. Second. I'll, I'll second nominate. Trey. Okay, so Fine. Chef second. So Trey is up as a candidate. We need one more. Nominate myself. Oh, I can't nominate. No, I can't nominate twice in a row. And Trey, because um, why, Gwam? 
So, <laughs> because there's not that many options left and yeah. he's claiming he's a role that he can't say what it is, but he's already said he's not the two roles that he can't say what they are. So I yeah. did. <laughs> I you did. You weren't the baby dragon. You said you weren't the, the voter person, and you said you weren't the baby dragon. Oh, uh, there's there's right there's one other role that can't say what they are. I so I nominate Graham. Okay, so Graham has been nominated. Is there a second for that? I second. Okay. Yeah, there's another role out there that can't say. Yeah, what they that are. is true. I just checked my list, and uh, the, there is yeah. one more. Yeah. Okay. I mean, this right. late in the game. And again, Graham, I'll go get my wife, and she can tell you for you. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> okay, so let's have Trace defense first of all. I I already I mean okay. I'm, I'm gonna say the same thing over because I Graham, do you have a defense? Not really. I mean if, if we think he's Guami Man, that's cool. Um I I think the one thing to consider if I'm gonna die here for the villagers is that the the uh roles did stack. So it is possible that somebody who is good could also be on the other team, but I don't think that matters. If they're the minion to, and the other werewolves are dead, I think it's fine. So. Okay. I think it sounds like we can go to a vote, right? So uh, I will mute you all. I will roll it up. And I like it when I can go down to a D6, actually. That's, that's nice. So that means classic Paul. You get to look and vote after everyone else. So everyone close your eyes except for Paul. And voting up means you want to kill Trey. Voting down means you want to kill Graham. In three, two, one, vote. Okay, so everyone can take their hand uh, down. And I'm sorry to say, Graham, you have been murdered by the village. Graham was a villager. And good night, everyone. So, it's getting down to, it's exciting here. It's getting down to the last people. And we are going to start with the Guami Man. So, Guami Man, uh, what do you want to do? Okay. Who do you want to do that to? Okay. Thank you. Um, let's have the wannabe Guam man wake up and you have to do this. Who do you want to do that to? Thank you. And bodyguard, who do you want to protect? Okay. And werewolves, who do you want to kill? Werewolves, you can wake up. Thank you. And Minion, who do you want to check? And Guamacabra, who do you want to try and kill? Okay, thank you. Um, Seer, who do you want to see? OK. 
Okay. Creepy old Guami Hag. Do you want to send someone out? All right. Guami Wolf. Do you want to do your thing? Whatever it is you keep doing every night. All right. And finally, the wannabe Guami Wolf. Do you want to do your thing? Okay, thank you. So, it's morning again. And let's see what happened here. Well, let's see here. So, okay, I messed up my notes a little bit. Uh, Chef is dead. Chef was a villager. Luciana is also dead. Luciana was a werewolf. So, um, what, the hell just, what happened? What the f this is a bit weird, but I'm gonna say congratulations to Trey, the uh, Guami Cabra, also known <laughs> as the Minion. You won by yourself. Oh you, my I, god, what? I don't know why you killed Luciana. That was kind of weird, but uh, you basically wanted to win by yourself, I guess. So, you did. Sure. Okay, so wait, <laughs> well, she wait, does wait, wait, kinda wait. win. Wait, 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 wait. Was Paul a werewolf? No. No. Then how did two kills happen? You, you killed her. You killed you Luciana. Killed well then who killed Chef? The the werewolf. Luciana. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna explain this is so much fun. I must say, first of all, guys, I'm so thankful for you being here playing this game with me because I didn't know she was a werewolf. I had such a hard time not laughing so many times during this game. I will, I will tell you some highlights, but I'm going to go over the roles first of all. This has been so confusing even for me. And I've been start trying to like, I, I've been looking at the Discord a little bit and I'm like, people are so confused and I'm still confused myself. Okay, so we had the villager, Melissa. Totally normal villager, nothing fancy. We had the normal villager, Graham, who survived uh, quite long. We had the cursed villager, Jamie, who turned into a werewolf when the werewolves tried to kill Jamie. Then we had the Guami bot, Manny, who had to agree with someone each day. I And I think he did. Uh, is Man no, I don't think Manny's around. I think he did, and then I don't really know. He died pretty early. We had the Guami bot, Paul, who had to claim a different role every day. But, but I didn't tell him that it, it had to be a role that was in the game. So I was trying to not laugh when he came up with the priest and whatnot. Uh, because, you know, I didn't t say specifically that it had to be a role that was in the game. So, yeah, that was really fun. Uh, good show there, Paul. And then we had the Guami bot, Adam, who had to ask a question each day. And I honestly don't know if you did. Uh, I didn't really keep track, but yeah. Okay, then we had the Van, who was a normal villager. Then we had Sean, who was a normal villager. We had... Pablo, the Guami man, who stayed alive a long time and did a lot of things. And I will say that I messed up one thing there. I, as far as I know, I did one thing wrong in this game. And that was the basically like night one, uh, Pablo chose to scare Chris. And I totally forgot that Chris was a werewolf. I'm so used to Chris being a good villager. So the werewolf shouldn't have had a kill that day. But yeah, I told Pablo in chat that, you know, please ignore whatever happened. You, your scare didn't work. They weren't scared of you. So I don't know. Uh, then we had the wannabe Guami man, Luciana, who was the wannabe Guami man the whole game, but she was turned into a werewolf. So she was a werewolf wannabe Guami man, which was really fun for me, at least. Uh, and I think for Luciana as well. It was really interesting. Then we have the Guami hag, Ben, who sent someone out and then he died and so on. We had the Guami voter, Jugan. And again, I didn't keep track, but I suppose you just, you know, voted up and down and yeah, I don't know. Then we had the baby dragon chef, and I was almost like, I think you tried to say that you were the baby dragon with some sport references that I didn't catch because I'm a Swede, but I don't know. I didn't want to kill, I'm, I'm never going to kill the baby dragon anyway. So then we had the hunter Kyle, which you know. Uh, bodyguard was Alex. Uh, the seer was Lucas. Uh, the Gormi Cabra, and this is the best in the whole game. The Gormi Cabra was Trey. And Trey was also chosen by Chris because Chris was the. Guami Wolf, and he chose Trey as the minion. 
So we just like we you know joked about before the game started. So we had the Gormicabra minion, and I had to message a lot with Trey because he didn't understand like what am I supposed to do now. And so he was on both teams and he had both win conditions and he won by himself, which was kind of cool actually. Then we had the Werewolf Elliot, the Werewolf Flick. We had the uh, Gormy Wolf Chris, who also chose to be a cub, which you could probably figure out. Uh, so when he died, two people died. Uh, Ayahu was the one big Gormy Wolf and he was the beta wolf, but he never got to do his power before he died or he didn't do it. Um, so then it transferred over to Matthew, who was the werewolf hunter. So he became both, it's random. So he was both the hunter and the beta wolf, which was an interesting combo because he could kill himself, turn Luciana into a werewolf and get the hunter kill. Yeah. So you probably have a lot of questions and stuff. So, you know, go ahead. All right. Let me hey. talk first. Hold on. Let me talk first. <laughs> you can take it to... with you. <laughs> Dude. All right. Hold on. I will say this. I believe Luciana was the wannabe Guami whatever the whole dang game i did not she know was, who the werewolves. Also. right but i didn't know who the werewolves were i had to use my minion power to figure out who you guys were and then halfway i thought you should see the chat that i had with joseph i was like dude i don't have a clue what i'm doing but i thought the moment i became the minion i lost my chupacabra win condition and halfway through the game i was like do i still like keep killing villagers if i can kill all the werewolves he's like yep and i said okay mission accomplished and so i started and i thought when it came down to jamie and who were the last two werewolves? It was Jamie and Chris. Chris. And Chris, you were, oh my God, dude, you're so bad at lying as a werewolf. <laughs> and I so wanted to die. I had to kill you. And then I was like, in my mind, Jamie was the last one. And I was like, if the Chupacabra doesn't kill the last obvious werewolf, then it would look suspicious that why would the Chupacabra not do that? And so I had to kill Jamie. And then I figured I was the Chupacabra. And then I guess, Luciana, you and I hit Lucas on the same night which yep. made me still think that we didn't have a werewolf. I thought I was the only one left. And I'm like, holy crap, <laughs> what am I doing? And then the last night, Chef and my target died. And I was like, what just happened here? <laughs> so I, and I did not kill, oh, Sean, by the way, I wasn't lying. I had no freaking clue what I was doing in this game. No freaking idea. <laughs> I was the victory. minion and the chupacabra. And no clue. <laughs> Fair enough. Sean, I wish people would listen to you as you started talking in the chat was blown up and they're like yes he, he <laughs> understands they might be bad <laughs> uh, I, I joseph just i just want to scenario happen would you i thought it wasn't train? possible at all so i wasn't even yeah. paying attention i was like okay i'm the cheaper copper there's no way i can be the minion and then he's like well everybody wake up and it says wait and i'll read it verbatim it says you're now the minion <laughs> ha ha have fun with it <laughs> i'm <laughs> like real quick really? well, well, okay. uh, hey, joseph you are the real... minion have yeah. fun uh, Jeff, jo Joseph, real quick, that wasn't that sports reference wasn't trying to cheat. It was okay. I was going to say the same exact thing again. <laughs> that's that's what it was referenced uh, to. But but anyways, I just want to let you know about that. I didn't yeah. try to. Yeah, but I'm confused about the minion. Isn't the minion part of the werewolf? Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. So he was yeah, both a werewolf. Technically still there. I, I feel won. like I lived. They not? So, so it, it was a werewolf win, right? When no, I think it was no, both. The last no, the werewolf died. So the. No, it, it was it but the minion was part fire. of the werewolf team and it was equal. And they, yeah, if the guess, werewolf team is ever yeah. equal, I that's why they... I say it's both. You yeah, also could you can also claim it's a both. both. Well, you can also have claim it's a village win though. I will just put this out there as the <laughs> yeah, you know. before I found out in the day one, before I found out I was the good minion, because I didn't know throughout the whole first day, I had three of you picked out. And I had to refrain from killing you. Chris, I I was the you were the first target. And I learned that you were the werewolf, and I thought so if you go back and watch the video, I forgot that the person who got sent out of the village doesn't get to see the night. And I'm like waving at you that I'm both roles. Uh -huh. <laughs> wow. And then I forgot that you could see because when I, Lucas went out, I was like, holy crap, he's going to see me as both roles. And I was like, wait a minute. Oh, no. He can't see me. So that means yeah. Chris didn't see me, which means I look like an idiot. Yeah, I thought you waved to me. <laughs> no, I was trying to get, I was trying to make sure Chris saw me. I, 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 I was like, yeah, yeah, hey, hi, hi. You were like, I thought you were waving to me. You're like, what is he doing? I was trying to communicate with Chris. And I wanted to die. I voted down on Ben. I, and then uh, Sean, I think it was, said who all voted. He saw who voted down on Ben. I was just like, I'm not going to say nothing. You guys come after well, me. And then Get halfway me. through the game, when I was Get still alive, out. I was thinking, I'm the, cub. the only way that I'm going to get through this is if I pretend to be the bot, which, Sean, that's what I couldn't reveal, that I was one of the robots. And that I had yeah, I knew what you were going for on that. Yeah. And my quirk was that, but my wife and my daughter were in here the whole time, and I was like, "What have I been doing that I could pass off?" And I was like, "Oh, 
talking to my wife. And Yosef's played games with Marianna before, so I was like, maybe he, that was my quirk, that I had to pretend <laughs> like I was talking to my wife every night or every day. <clears throat> and so, no, I, yeah, I, I can't with, believe with that I keep winning these games as bad guys when I have no <laughs> idea what I'm doing. I figured that there's no way that you can claim a role every day and not look suspicious, so I just had fun with it, and I just picked random roles that weren't even in the game. Oh, it's fine. It was, it was oh, Joseph, great. Joseph, Joseph, I have a suggestion. Can you cut all of Paul's roles and claims and turn them into a song? Yeah, I can do that. When he said I was, I was looking at notes from a day before, I was like, did nobody catch that? What is that about? Well, well I, I figured was the, the, the werewolves were going to was good. I'm ignoring Paul. <laughs> <laughs> I thought the werewolves were going to kill me because I was a bot, or I thought the villagers were going to be like, oh, that's good werewolf cover. We're going to kill you. So I was like, I'm going to die soon anyway. Well, I, I was bro, actually bro, thinking that. I was like, is it so over the top? Are you actually a werewolf? I was so <laughs> I was lost thinking. that I thought you were being truthful. I was like, dude, how do you still have your notes from the day before and for mess them up? I was like, what the heck is going on? <laughs> I, was I, was, I was almost going to let the last day play <laughs> out because it was interesting. Just like, I just wanted to see Trey's reaction a little bit more before I said anything, but... <laughs> and when he said that, it, when, when I you said, said Ayahu, Chef died, I, I was like, I didn't pick Chef. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> I said Ayahu was a villager or whatever. I actually forgot that he was a werewolf, which is why I said that. But then I just added extra confusion, I guess, because. Um, yeah, sure. No, I, I lo- and let me also say, Lucina, you played that wonderfully after you got turned. How did Thank you, you. Uh, Joseph, Adam S wants yeah, to go back just, into the I meeting. I killed myself, so I killed myself and turned, turned Luciana. Yeah, yeah that, okay. I that think was that good. was the best play from Matthew. Yeah, killing no, himself, great. turning <laughs> someone, and then killing again. So that was great. That was, no, that was great. The gu- I was the so... person then when she died. What? So when, when Luciana she didn't died, die. She didn't die. She didn't die. Oh, so she just it lost stacks. the Guana be the wannabe Guami. So she, person. no, she had both. She had both. Oh, she had both. Oh, just yeah. like you. That was so a very was strong werewolf. <laughs> On the same night, she yeah. could, she could you know, do two things. Like she that's why I want to count it as a werewolf win because Matthew's play was so well, genius. You are, you are yeah. correct. It is both the werewolf and the chupacabra win, I guess. That's uh, what I thought. I mean, Trey is on the werewolf team. Well. Actually, not a true cover win. Like, the game would have ended at four. I've been trying to get myself killed. Two werewolves and two villagers, so the game would have ended at four. It, but that was going into the werewolf. night. No, but the minion doesn't count. No, no, the minion doesn't, doesn't count. Yeah, oh, minion doesn't count. count okay, I'm, but the minion does count as a werewolf, so it's both. That's so weird. But, but it, it is really weird. I would be seen as a villager. I'll take it. I Sienna, were you happy to be turned? Sorry, what? Were you happy when I turned you? Kind of, because yeah. I was like, I was cleared, so that was a lot of fun. <laughs> but Luciano, yeah, well, you were really confused when I told you you're a werewolf, and, and you like yeah. asked me if you've been cursed, and you were no, like, no, 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 I was work? asking for for Graham because I was um thinking of oh. killing him instead of Lucas, so I'd have at least one more because Jamie and Chris died right away. Well, okay, I get it out because that was the same night I checked, and I was confused also because I checked Matthew with my minion roll, and and Joseph <laughs> told me that he was a werewolf, and then I killed somebody or i picked somebody else to die or like bluffed it because i had to like pretend not to kill people a whole bunch yeah. of times and then we I, came back and he's like matthew's dead and i'm like no dude you got him mixed up i, <laughs> I, like, I, I even i even didn't say that i checked matthew as a werewolf and it still didn't work because he still killed himself right so, so Trey, you you're checking like, you're why, why you're check me, Lucas? Not i checked you yeah <laughs> But I, I didn't want to tell because I didn't want the beta wolf, you know, to trigger. But you oh. still triggered it. But, but Trey, Trey, um, you killed two werewolves, which is really funny. And who, I, what other werewolf did I kill? Uh, Jamie. I killed Jay. I killed oh yeah, Jamie you killed Jamie. Jamie. Well, Jamie was obvious because if the chupacabra at that point in time, because oh, if I had oh, died, yeah, yeah. you would have told everybody that I was the chupacabra, correct? Yeah, if you died, yeah. Okay, so if if it came down to we were both really suspicious on Chris and Jamie, it, it was obvious that the Chupacabra should have targeted Jamie that night, regardless of what team I was on. Because, because I, I, been... I would think like when Luciana and Jamie were werewolves and Chris died, I was thinking like they don't know that you're the minion. So they might try okay, to so kill who you. Knew that I was, was the minion? Who, who Chris knew I was the Chris. Only Chris. Only Chris. He chose you. <laughs> it, was, it was funny oh. when Chris woke up, because I think you woke up and you're like, oh, there's two new werewolves. Yeah, that was funny. I'm like, what the hell just happened? <laughs> like, where did these people come from? <laughs> oh, that's right. Yeah, no, I had no idea Luciana was a werewolf at all. I thought I was having to pull it out my butt there at the end. I don't think I ever seen that before. Two werewolf, two villagers turned into werewolves on the same day, and then we had the night where like four people died, and it's like, 
crazy things happening, which is fine. Yeah, that's that right. Because fun. technically, yeah. I wasn't we're doing really well. No, I didn't kill Lucas. She did. I did. Yeah. I thought <laughs> I killed Lucas because no werewolves were left. Because I picked Lucas. If I had picked anybody else, I would have realized that another werewolf was still in the game. Yeah. yeah. I thought yeah. I was the only one left, oh, yeah, and yeah, I yeah. killed yeah. Lucas. Which yep. is why at the last night I just checked Chef. Oh no, I checked Paul just to make. Sure. It was the same idea. I checked Paul just to make sure, and he said no. But then I said, okay, now I'm going to kill Luciana because I was convinced that you were the good wannabe Guami person. Wow, that's <laughs> messed up, dude. That was that was man. that was awesome. That was awesome. <laughs> that was, so I, was, I had was no awesome. idea what I was doing. Trey, I was Trey, if you hadn't killed anyone that night, so if you hadn't picked Luciana. You would have woken up, and the only people would have been able to speak were the werewolf and the minion, because Trey the Chef would have been silenced. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and Paul would have been silenced, and the only people who would have been able to talk would have been Trey and Luciana. It would have been one person. <laughs> yeah. I really wanted to see that because I wanted to uh, be like, wow. would they come out to each other? <laughs> because like, if they just start talking, I would have never can... known. I would have. <laughs> Be like Draco. Follow Board Games with Niramas on Facebook at BGW Niramas. <laughs>